Greetings, fellow survivors. Madstone here, and welcome back to Plains of Pain. This is Season 2 Early Alpha Access. So let me explain what I'm doing. Let's get out of the weeds here. Um, I decided to go ahead and just start fresh, including the season, uh, now that I've had a lot of time to play. And one of the big things I'm changing is I'm going to record the videos one day, release them the next day. Um, and the main reason is that because the game is so active, the developers are so active, that I want to be able to respond to people's comments and suggestions and tips the next day. Because normally, I usually record these in a batch. And so I could record them on a Saturday or Sunday. And then someone watches a video on Tuesday, makes a comment, and it wouldn't have taken any effect until, obviously, till the next weekend. And same thing with the, there's updates coming out and with the developers being so active and me learning things every day, I said, this will be better and might as well just start fresh so that the playlist and everything will make more sense to people. Because if I just keep restarting then the main one, it'll just get confusing. So I figured I'll get ahead and cut that one off where it is. We'll let it finish off with the episode eight, I believe it was. I actually had nine, 10, 11, and 12 in the can, but uh, I started running into problems with building because I hadn't learned or played with it yet and found out uh, currently in its current state, there's some items you can't tear down and I ended up with a colossal mess of a build. So it was embarrassing and I didn't want to show it to the public anyway. So um, yes, we'll be starting same map key, new character. I wanted to start fresh and let me see what else. And we are on a public beta, uh, the new, I think it's 519 which has the new map UI. I haven't even looked at it yet. Okay, so we now have zoom in and out. We can move our mouse pointer around. And we also have our commands over here. So mouse button zoom, left mouse bus button. Looks like it says double tap. Double tap to add a POI. Single tap to edit the POI. Right mouse to move the map. So we can move the map around, cool. So we zoom out. See how big our map is. We have some pre-selected points of interest here. And so if I go over and collect, uh, click on aged hole, you'll see down below now, I could change the name, change the label, change the color of the icon. Uh, 3D view is if you want to be able to see it from a distance. So that's great when you're trying to locate specific places. You can just look around and you'll be able to see it in the, in the real world. Uh, we have icons we can choose. And then they added a little note field. Whoever the added that to the map is a genius. Anyway, uh, <laughs> so yeah, you could add your own personal notes. And then on the side here, we got our filters. And this works pretty standard. Uh, right now, everything is uh, visible. So like I got an, the aged hole here, which is a junkyard. I could click the button, graze out, picture goes away. That way, if you're trying to, as your map gets full, you can uh, declutter it. Another thing will be that this is um, auto-generated icons, meaning certain things will automatically add themselves to the map. So when you certain points of interest, gas pumps, water wells, uh, in the towns and POIs like that, they'll they'll make their own icon and and the names that go with them. And then down here, visibility. I play single player, so it doesn't really matter. But if you're playing on a server or multiplayer. This allows you to be invisible to other players, visible to other players, and then team mode, you put a code in here and everybody else in your team has that code, then you, you can all track each other. So again, I don't need that right now, so we'll put it back to just visible. And what's left over here, and that's our normal menu, yep. All right, so let's go ahead and hit mouse to close. Let's see if that still works. I mean, M to close. All right. So let's figure out where we are. There's Frank and Ron. We kind of know the area. Uh, let's grab some materials. Oh yeah, let's go ahead and go into our crafting menu and let's get our uh, bone knife going. So we have a melee weapon. All right. And then I'm gonna highlight my mouse over there and hit the number one key. Put that in my hot slot for me. And that was also a quest. So we took our first quest. So that's an early thing. I highly suggest do all these little quests that pop up in the top 
uh, left of the screen. They really do help you uh, level up and learn and unlock things. They even kind of push you around the map a little bit. All right, now we do need to keep an eye on food and water. Six o'clock in the morning, so we have a few hours before it starts getting hot, hot. All right, so let's check in with our buddies here. All right. So we just completed that mission, which was to come hang out with these guys. And also we have another mission that says create or craft a can on a wire. We should have the material for that. Let's look in our inventory one time. And we'll go to equipment. And it's right there. Now that one is a wire can of dog or can empty can and a uh, bone knife. But what I want to do is I have a can of canned food, but I haven't eaten any of it yet. So we're going to drag that down. We're going to right click the knife, drag it on top so it turns green. And there we go. We just opened that can. And now we're just going to hold the left mouse button and he'll start chomping down. Now, he'll pretty much stop eating food out of the can once you've maxed out the... Uh... Oh, will he keep eating? Let me see. No, he'll keep eating, but you're already maxed out your food. I'm just going to keep eating it just for the fun of it so that it's empty and I don't feel like I wasted the food completely. All right. And then I'm going to make my little can craft cans on the wire. So what this actually is, is a storage device. So again, I'm doing a little bit of a first time tutorial for new players. So just uh, follow along everyone and we'll speed into things here just a little bit. But we've got multiple slots for our equipment that includes headwear, left shoulder, chest, right shoulder. We got our main uh, shirt jacket, which is permanent right now. And same with pants. Those are always the default of your, whenever you pick the character at the beginning, that's the clothes you have. Uh, maybe later on we'll be able to change those out. We got a backpack. This is kind of new for, I don't know, there might be some other games, but this is the first time for me. This is a waste pouch, which is what we're working on. Cans and a wire, so it's an additional storage. Then we have the uh, eyewear and the mask slot. All right, so we're going to go ahead and hit craft. And we just finished another quest, and we just leveled up to level one. And now we have this item here, cans and a wire. I'm going to drag it. Now I can drag it here, or I can double click. And if the slot's empty, it fills in. And you'll now see we have a new category. And again, if you're new to the game, uh, this one works a little differently than some games. You'll see there's no slots per se, no little boxes to fill in or limit you. It is all based on a combination of weight and volume. So this, my pants will hold up to three kilograms or three liters in volume of items. So what'll happen is you may have small items, don't take a lot of space, but they're heavy can fill you up fast or in another case like these planks you could end up with a handful of planks that don't weigh much but they take up a lot of space so those for instance that plank is one liter of volume so it's already taken up a third of our bag anyway let's get out of here now we're going to talk to these two guys initially we're going to talk to frank now if you look under his little uh f barter icon there there's a picture of a bag which is barter mouse wheel over and that'll say ask for a job so when you meet anybody in the game that'll talk to you they may have multiple options and you use the mouse wheel to go back and forth we're just going to ask him for a job so i'm going to hit I meant the f key not the mouse button and it'll basically say here sell rusty knife okay we don't have one so we got to find one so we'll keep an eye out for it and then we're going to talk to his partner here Oop, I actually opened the inventory. There we go. And he's going to give us a quest to craft a stone pickaxe. So we got two quests. We don't really have much gear to work with. So we're going to start collecting. So let's start going through these boxes. Now it says uh, F key to interact. Uh, you can hold it down. And if you hold it down, he'll just keep looting until that container is empty. So you'll get used to like the large ones or three tries smaller ones may only be one one loot ring but it does go a little faster if you just kind of hold the key down now i'm going to show you here a mistake i already made not big, not a big mistake it's just started but i leveled up so i needed to jump over here and again always consult the right hand side of the screen i leveled up so i need to check my skills oh hang on hang on, hang on. 
Oh, yeah, they're throwing rocks at us. Okay. <laughs> now, right now, I don't really have any good weapons. I have this knife. Yeah, they got him. They got some people coming. Anyway, let's get back over here. So let's go to J. And I need to start spending points right away. You, you want to take advantage of these as early as possible to get all the bonuses. Now, they haven't filled in details like percentages or anything so you can do your min-maxing. But overall, you just kind of read through. I already kind of have a plan of what I want to do. And again, last season, I really messed it up. I uh, wasn't paying attention. I would go three or four levels without checking. And the biggest thing I messed up on is I like to build and I didn't spend any points under Architect to save myself materials, which are very critical early on. But right now, what we're going to concentrate on is Scavenger. I want to reduce... Uh, well, hang on. Reduce weapon and tools wear. Yeah, and tools while providing a higher chance of finding rare items. That's actually what I'm looking for. Finding rare items or yielding greater quantities of loot. That's the part that we're really interested in. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to, I'm going to go with the whole 10. Because to me, I loot a lot early on. There we go. And they're actually, uh, go check on these two guys they killed. Because they could have some good loot. Look at that. I'm going to go F key. Because we do have a little bit of space. And we'll go ahead and see where that other guy... Look for the bones. There he is. They'll leave a little skeleton bones. They'll slowly be absorbed by the... Uh, the uh, sand will cover them up over time. Okay. Now, if you do kill a bunch and you get them stacked on top of each other and you can't get underneath and you have uh, the opportunity to make a pickaxe, you can actually use that to break up the bones so you can get to the next level underneath. All right. Hold down the F key. And let's see. You got some rope. Rusty nuts. Okay. And we got another quest up there. They want us to build a stone stash. But we really need the pickaxe first. So we need to locate some materials to get that pickaxe going. So let me finish this here. I think we've got all the stuff in the area. We haven't lucked out on getting a stone yet. Okay, so we did get some sticks. So let's go over here. Back into crafting. Go to tools. Now, we could make a stone hammer. Uh, what, we, what we really want to make is this guy here. So how can we make... Okay, we can make a stone hammer. So we must be missing something. Nails. Okay. We have not gotten any nails yet. Okay, so that's what's holding us up. So let's go talk to our buddy Ron. He's a he's a good wheeler and dealer. Let's see if he's got anything that he's willing to trade. Okay, we don't have any yet, but if we can collect some rusty knives, he'll trade those for nails. So what I want to do is let's take peek our head up over here and see what's going on over here. Because I think according to the map, there's a town over here. And there's a some water right there. We'll keep an eye on that. So towns like this are a good place to gather resources early on. Just like at Frank and Ron's place, there'll be containers all over and you're free to loot them. And they're actually getting attacked right now. Oh, in fact, there's a guy here. Let's see if we can get... Oop, I missed. So they're overrunning the town. Now, I can't afford... Oh, man. Are they being that run? Oh, they're being swarmed. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> yeah, not a good place. You gotta watch out, especially that bone crusher right behind me. Oh, yeah. You guys are... Oh! Yeah, this is not the place to be. Level 1. With no gear. Now, one thing I learned... Stealth does work in the game. Oh, there's more of them. Holy crap. They're being raided. Look at that. We've got a whole army behind us. But I found that you can hide. Now, that probably won't work. You know, but if I get up behind the hill, maybe. I've had this work for me where they give up if you hide and they can't see you anymore. So we're going to run over here. Go to stealth. Yeah, see, they all turned around. So again, it's nice to see a stealth mechanic that does work. Now, this game is not very uh, forgiving, so the heat's coming in. 
we don't have anywhere to hide other than this little uh, shack here. And we don't have any early access to the uh, town because it's being raided like it is. They might have killed most of the vendors, too. So I'm looking around. Let's just kind of poke around a little bit. I don't want to get too far from my because I may have to run back over there. I'm just looking to see if there's any abandoned tents, little campsites. See, I don't even really know if I can handle this guy, but let's try. This weapon we have is pretty weak. Yeah, it's pretty embarrassingly weak right now. Oh, and he just hit us with it. I'm just gonna try not to get hit. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to... We don't have any defensive moves right now. So most of them doing these drive-bys. Just gotta push it a little earlier. There we go. Now you do have a stamina bar you gotta keep an eye on. It's mostly related to combat. Oh, look at that. Okay. I don't even know if this guy's taking... He's taking a little bit of damage. Well, let's head back to Ron and Frank's. One thing they're good at is shooting bad guys. So let's take them over here. You poor hop along. In fact, oh, he's throwing rocks at us again. I'm going to run up the hill here. He may give up. Oops, someone's... Oh, it's the town still. Someone in there is still fighting. Man, this place is crowded. Uh-oh, he saw me. Ooh. <laughs> Every playthrough is different, even on the same map. Oh, they got him. Okay, let's... I'm going to hit... I'll take all real quick. And then we're going to see if these guys... This may be too much for them, even. This guy's pretty big. I'm going to try to keep him following me so they can put arrows in him. This will probably tear them up, and then we'll be out without a vendor for a while. Come on. I'm just going to... No, he can one-hit. Especially me. He'll take me out with one swing. Yeah, I don't think his health's going down at all. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of him. Oh, 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 don't do that. Oh, he didn't fall for that one, did he? No, he didn't fall for that. Yeah, he's too smart for that. <laughs> okay, that guy got winded. Oh, they're getting swarmed. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, there they go. Man. These poor guys are going to get... They're going to get tore up. Let's see if we get this guy. When they bend over and start breathing like that, they're ready to be taken out. There we go. Oh, man. I, I led the whole army in here, I guess. So they're, they're bleeding in from up above our health is okay our water's getting low okay they got a lot of dead here oh no here he goes I'm gonna try to get some free shot oh that was close that could have that could have killed us now I, I could jump on top of the building and hide but I'd rather help these guys as much as I can we just need the big guy gone. If they can kill the Hulk, we can survive. Oh, no, we got another Hulk. Oh, no. It's getting really bad. I just don't have a, be a better weapon yet. Oh, my God. The whole army's coming. Man, this is terrible. How many are there? Did they kill Ron? And oh, man, they're going. Oh, man. Yeah, this is terrible. <laughs> now they can hit each other and hurt each other, so. That guy's st stuck. I was hoping we'd get. Come on. I just need a better weapon. Uh, I can't even get a break from these guys. They're, they're taking them to town, though. 
They just keep swarming. Oh no, they killed. Did they kill? No, they didn't. Okay. Okay. Oh, he took down the big guy. Oh, oh, they're oh. They're doing good. All right. They're just coming out of the wood. Well, not out of the woods. They're coming out of the desert. <laughs> All right. Yeah, they're still coming. Look at them. I'm ready to loot. Now, they will fade away, so we got to try to get in here before they... Now, these guys don't necessarily have the best gear, or even gear at all, but they may have enough to get us started. A big thing for us is we need uh, some stone. Oh, we need the nails. Okay. And we have a stone. So I don't want to get overloaded just yet. So I'm looking for nails. Let's see if we can get enough nails. In fact, okay, let's do this. Let's get the cloth. And the bone knives. We can trade the bone knives to Frank for other gear. Cloth. And what's in there? That's dirty water. I'll hold on to that just in case. I'm hoping we can get everything going here in a second. Oh, there's another bone knife. Yeah, I'm hoping I can get these bodies. Okay. No, 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 no. We don't have a lot of carry space. That's why I'm being really selective. In fact, I'm going to put this board here. Oh, there's a... St we, need one. we want some stone. There's our... Okay, we got the nails. All right. So let's get these quests out of the way. I'm going to go ahead and get the hammer made. Now, you have to have everything in the right quantities somewhere in your stacks. Now, I think I, I still kind of questioning this. If I drag this down here and where's the sticks at? Seems like we got the another plank in there and some nails and a stone. So don't still understand this. Yeah, this is not enough. So all I know is I got two here. Oh, we're short a stick. No, we're not. Here we go. So if we stack them together, then it works right there. Okay. I do need to ask the devs for a little more detail on that. Okay, and then in order to make this, we're going to be short a stick. Okay. So let's go back through these guys real quick. There's a stick. I want that hammer. So we'll go back to craft. Get the hammer. All right. And then we're going to take that pickaxe. So I'm going to put that into slot two, hammer into three, and the water on four. Now you can also drag. I could have just dragged him here. But if you hit the hot key while you have inventory, it'll auto assign. Okay, so he wants us to get five small stones. So luckily, there is a nice boulder here. And again, just hold down the E key, your uh, F key. I reassigned it, so... And just let it slowly chip away. Until we get our five stones. And it'll slowly count up there for us. There we go. All right, we're complete. So let's see. And did we get any rusty knives with all those guys? Let's look around again. They're going to start to fade away. I'm going to try to grab a little bit. And I'll show you the next thing here as soon as I get some inventory. I'm trying to concentrate on the more important stuff. Bones, I'm not completely worried about at this moment. Cloth is the big thing. There's some cloth there. And rope. Keep the dog food. Planks are important, but they're just too big right now. What we want to try to do is get ourselves into the next cloth. Or, I'm sorry, into a bigger bag storage. Okay. Okay, so we're starting to fill up here. Yeah, everything's turning red. All right. Now we build a stone stash. Okay. This is just going to be a one-off temporary deal since we like to hang out with Ron and Frank a lot. I'm going to go around to the back of their building and I'm going to hit the uh, B key for build. 
And under storages, we have one option right now, which is to build the stone stash, and it takes 10 stone. So I'm gonna place the blueprint down, and then I'm gonna hit my F key, and now you see how everything's spread out? The reason for that, because people get confused on that, is there's conditioning. See this condition right underneath the title? 62, 21, 51. That's the quality of that item. And you want to get as high a quality as you want, as you can, and you can stack. So right here, this was 24, this is 65. If I middle mouse on the higher quantity, or the higher quality, it drags the other ones into it. Same here, 62, 51, so we want the 62. And then the last one here, can't do much about it unless there's some carry space here. And then we'll bring that one in, and then we're full there. But we're putting them in here anyway. And let's see how close we got. Well, we leveled, even though we didn't finish. We need two more stone. So let's take our pickaxe over here real quick, break out a couple more stone and finish that off. And this will be a little spot where we can hide materials and loot and whatever we want. I'm playing single player, so I don't have to worry about anybody stealing my stuff. Uh, a trick I would say, I haven't played multiplayer, but one trick would be, you could always, if you can remember where, and you can use the new map for that, I could walk into here, say, and put one down to where people couldn't see it, and then I could mark it on my map. But for now, I'm just going to put it in an easy to locate spot. Go back to finish it off. Drag that stone and that stone. Okay, now it'll finalize itself. And we just finished that quest. Okay. And we did level, so we are going to check on that in a second. Okay, now it wants us to build a wooden box, which I'll probably build here too, if the materials are still here. But let's go ahead and open this up. And I'm going to start putting some of this stuff away. Pretty much all of it for now, so that we can, and some of this is a kind of a mistake as far as I need to be checking the uh, quality. So like that's 44, and if I had other rags, if I throw something on top, it inherits the level of what's there. So that's 67, this one's 39, so that's okay. Uh, like the nuts here, these are 43, 56, 47, so I'm going to put this heavier one or higher quality condition middle mouse now they've gone up and then I can dump the other ones on top and get the better quality so doesn't matter on the bugs and these two we're going to double yeah, mouse click there rope is important 34, 58 so we'll put that one on top rope can be broken down so pay attention under your crafting menu under materials if some items can be broken down, like rags. You can make rags out of rope. And uh, some of the stuff works back and forth to where iron scrap can be made by taking an iron sheet apart. Or you can make an iron sheet by putting together iron scraps. So, always take a look in there. Let's finish kind of emptying it out here. The garlic can be used for food. But more importantly, you'll need it for men uh, cooking some recipes. Also for first aid, and let's see here. And I am aware that my water is getting low, and I'm gonna take care of that in just a second. I'm just trying to break this down. Okay, we're good here. And let's see, let's go ahead and keep the can of dog food up here along with our water. What else can I tell you guys? Uh, that was dirty water, yeah. And there's a barrel up top, so we're probably gonna go visit that. So if you hold down the... Uh, left mouse button while you have the container in your hand and you'll use the function of that. So we just drank all our water. It is red and our health went red because we were drinking dirty water, but that's all we have. So you just want to try to keep your health up while you're doing that. But there was a barrel right here. We're going to go check on it. And the first thing you want to do with a barrel is never assume it is what it is. Even though it's blue, it may not be water, so go to the end, inspect. That is indeed 0.59 liters. I will go ahead and I have a couple options here, like like with the quest, like the merchants. I can drink, I can pour out, fill in, or inspect. So I'm actually gonna drink right now, right out of the bottle, right out of the container. And I'm gonna drink again. 
try to get that up most of the way. If you don't keep your food and water up, you'll, you'll start to have mental problems and you'll go crazy and you'll lose control of your character and he can eventually die. Okay, I'm going to go back to Phil, see if there's anything left. And we got 0.3, so, which is all this thing can hold. So let's drink again. Because this is a small container. Okay, now let's inspect it and see if it's empty. There's still 0.1, so let's go ahead and drink a little bit left there. Okay. Now, health will stay red for a while until it goes down. If it starts counting down, though, be careful. Make sure you can heal yourself, which I don't have a lot of options. What I can do is I can eat some dog food, but we also have the uh, garlic. So I'm going to get a piece of garlic and go ahead and put that in our inventory. You can also double click to transfer. I'm going to put it in my hand. And I'm gonna hold down and chomp that down. And there you can see there, our health went up. And it also should, there we go, it helped clean up our little health problem, I think, there. So we're all good to go. Now let's hit up these bodies. I, a lot of them have already dissolved or fell into the earth. But let's see if we can see any red anywhere. They can go pretty quick. Okay, we're gonna go up to town again. Because part of our quest here is we need to build a wooden box. Oh, the rag backpack. Hang on. Let's go back to inventory. Or crafting, equipment. The rag backpack. Ten. Okay, so that's ten uh, rags and one rope. Also, this is just showing you the options for different tools you have to have. You have to have one of these. At least one of these to be able to craft that item and we actually have the bone knife i'm going to go back into here and just take a quick inventory we had nine so we're like so close but remember we can take rope so i'm going to split this i'm going to put a rope in my hand go into craft material rope go ahead and cut that up and we got four more rope i'm sorry four more rags we'll go back to search into the box. These were sitting at 44%, 48. So I'm going to drag these here and then I'm going to middle mouse. Now you can craft from an open container. So if the container's open and I hit C, it's going to combine all this together and let me know that yes, you can make this item. So in this case, we want to make the bag, hit craft once. And if there's room in your inventory, which we did have right here. We got the bag. Let's go ahead and exit out and then bring it back up. And I'm gonna double click and it automatically drops in there. Now we've got some breathing room, eight liters of volume and 10 kilograms of weight. And as we did before, we're gonna put that plank in here because we're gonna need a few of them. And you'll see, uh, let's see, let's go ahead and put this away. I'll keep the food with us. We'll keep that little bit of garlic. Yeah, everything else looks stable. Uh, I don't have any more knives in here. And the roaches are okay where they're at. But we're gonna go back to our buddy Frank. I'm sorry, Ron. Ron likes to trade. He likes to buy stuff from you, including these uh, bone knives for wire. So I take every opportunity I can to turn those in because you're gonna need a lot of this for construction. Now, another trick here, a lot of the vendors, when you buy parts from them, they sell really nice parts. So see, he's got, these are way up better than what we were getting. So we're gonna take the 81 middle mouse. So we have three at 81. And again, we don't wanna go carrying this stuff too far initially. So we're back in here, we don't have any wire yet. We'll put it in. Now, the cool thing will be now, what I did last time and I'm still learning, but what what I had my mind set to was once I get a base going, my little survival shack, I'll start putting crates down and I'll have one that is my premium parts. And you'll want to always leave at least one of everything in there that's in the, hopefully in the 90s. Then when you come in, you drop everything into there and they'll all upgrade to that higher level. And then you can transform where you need them. So it's kind of a 
thing I'm thinking about as a as a go to is to always have a crate, or maybe a couple of crates, depending on how much stuff you have, where you have some of your always spare out an extra high level item once you find one, so you can use it to make everything else better. All right, so we've got a couple of missions: craft a crossbow, build a wooden box, sell a rusty knife. So we are also got to learn a recipe. This is the blueprint for wooden crates. So if I go into crafting right now, I'm sorry, into blueprints, I only know how to make a stone stash. So let's go back out. We put it in our hand. We'll hold down the mouse button. Uh, oh, you gotta close the window. Hold down my left mouse button as it tells me. And he learned the recipe. So now if we go into here, we got a wooden box. Now we know 10 nails, 10 wood. And we only have like two or three wood right now. So let's head back. We know that water's empty. Now the vendors may all be dead, so we'll see what happens. And this will be interesting with the map, because I haven't used this map yet. We're going to zoom in a little bit. And it's already got a gas can showing up, which stands for gas station. So it's telling us there's a gas station in town. Oh, and here's a barrel. So again, uh oh, uh oh, we got to get inside. That was gasoline. That's a good item, but we're just not ready for that. Uh, these are meteor storms. They happen a lot. Let's see if we can see without getting hit by one. Yeah, you see them coming down? Now, the cool thing about these... Oh, that's close. Hey, hang on. Oh! <laughs> You're safe inside, so they left a rock behind. A meteorite. That meteorite... With the uh, pickaxe, which we have... Uh, we can break that up, get some uh, ore out of it, and uh, you can find machines around the map that'll grind that into other parts or materials. And in fact, we can even show that off because there is a grinder in this town. Okay, let's go ahead and strip this place down real quick. So far, we haven't... Okay, we got another stone. And we got a bearing. The bearings are good. Everything in the game is good, is needed, or is valuable to somebody. Whether you need it or somebody else does. So let's get our pickaxe out. And we're just going to go over here. Oh, I lost my... Oh, there we go. Now, I won't be able to do a lot. As you can see, our pickaxe was pretty busted up. That goes back to the materials I had when I made it. They were all low-level materials. So I could only make low-level tools right now. If I had, like... 80 or 90 percent pieces then it would have been a lot better quality now you can on the pickaxe and most other tools you can repair them using the right items the only thing that's not repairable as of this date is the uh hammer when you break it it's broken but don't throw them away because they still have value and we'll see that later on i'm sure so again it's hardly anything you ever throw away outside of you just can't carry it anymore I'm going to go ahead and put that knife away. Now, if you want, or the pickaxe, if you want to get your hands empty and without accidentally throwing stuff away, hit the G key, empties your hand. Now, if you have something in your hand, let's go back, and you want to dump it, like you're like, I'm done with this, or you want to drop it off to a friend, hit the H key, and that'll drop it out of your hand. Okay, and we'll pick that back up for now. So we're just going to start looting because we need to get moving here. It's hot. You can see the sun is getting hotter. It's noon, high noon. Temperature's 46 Celsius and climbing. And we are already down to what little bit of water we have, like 0.3 liters. So I am going to try my best to get some good loot here. Planks are a big thing, so we can get the next quest done. And also we need to look at how to make the crossbow. Okay, here's something I learned. Uh, keep a hammer with you because a lot of barrels that aren't lootable will be uh, breakable where you can break scrap off of them. All right, and I just got one piece of iron scrap. It's a one hit. I'm going inside because of the heat. Now you see that? My temperature started going down. So you got to be careful being out in the sun too long. And we're going to take advantage of this because we did level. So if you look at the very top of the screen with the little... Uh, Experience bar in the center on the left hand side is current level right hand is the next level. So we're currently level two 
So I know that means I have points. You get 10 per level. The reason I have 12 is because some quest will honor or yeah, will reward you with an extra point. So you'll start getting some odd numbers in there. All right, so I am actually gonna take Scavenger up another 10. Because right now it's real important to get as much stuff as we can and as good a quality as we can. And in, in better, better quantities, I should say. All right, I'm gonna hold two points, I think. I'm gonna wanna start putting them in there, but I'm trying to do this one 10 at a time. And we'll just kind of let those other ones accrue for a little bit. Okay, let's keep searching while we can indoors. We are going to need to get some water here. I'm hoping we stumble across. Nobody sells water that I know of. I haven't ever seen anybody yet. Uh, they're real stingy on that, that front. This is a vendor, so we are going to go ahead and talk to him. He doesn't have a quest. He only has the one option. Okay, but we can see here. So here, let me give you a quick lesson here. Whatever's on the left is the item to give, and the right side is the receive. So this is basically, give me 140 rusty nuts and you'll get a air filter mask. So you can kind of see he's mostly selling gear and then he's buying some stuff back. Yep, he's buying, he's selling, oh, he's selling the little trainster here he's buying now that's good to know he buys this weapon for two gold that's pretty good but when you fight some higher tier creatures or people you can get some of these weapons and come back here and trade them now what's going to happen every time you talk to somebody it goes into a little internal database in your mind and when you go to an item in your inventory certain items I don't know if right there. Okay, so see this here, this rock? Look at the bottom under Auto Intel Trader. Best sell to Rustic Ron. So it's telling me, oh, Rustic Ron will buy rocks for uh, three rusty nuts. So that's how you'll eventually find out and know where to go to trade stuff in or where to buy stuff for the best price. Once you've discovered them, you have to discover the people and see their prices. So... Oh, look at that. Those iron sheets are actually good. Planks are what we really need right now. And we're going to bust that up. Yeah, hammers are very important. I didn't realize that early on. And uh, the problem was they break so fast. But that helps to have the better quality materials so you make them in the 90 percentile range. Okay, we're starting to get some planks. And some rusty nuts. What's this? Let's see, we're down to 36 and we're out of water. So we're gonna hit our four key. We're gonna drink what we have left, or at least drink as much as we can. 0.16. Yeah, it's probably gonna take the whole bottle. 0 0.9. 0 0.2. Might as well go the distance. And we are now tapped out. We gotta be careful with the heat. We're also getting tired. You see the little Z's down here. If it gets bad enough, you'll uh, it'll start affecting your combat and your movement and everything else. Okay, we did have a garlic. I probably shouldn't stand out in the sun, but I'm going to go ahead and eat that garlic. See if that'll give us a push in the health department. It probably wasn't enough. Okay, let's keep looting and talking to the vendors. No, it's hot. Yeah, I got to get back inside. That's going to make my thirst go faster. Let me just finish what I'm doing so I don't lose track. We'll come back and talk to that guy. Let's go to one of these bigger buildings here. Get out of the sun. Okay, Viper Frank. He's a, uh, what I call a nut changer, rusty nut changer. So he'll take like here, 112, get you one gold. 170 gold, gets you one Wolfram. One gold gets you 20. So you can see the ch exchange rate happening here. He's actually making a profit pretty good. Okay. We're not anywhere in the league of needing to be changing nuts right now. We need basic gear. We want to keep pushing. We want to get a way better... Oh, where'd my hammer go? We want to get a way better backpack than what we got. Okay. Oh, that one's... Okay. Yeah, we're getting some iron scrap. 
I do need to check inventory because we can't get overloaded and we'll start dropping stuff on the ground. All right, we're good here. We're getting close. See those numbers, but we actually have our can on the wires empty. It's only good for like 0.7 and 1. Our pockets are still pretty much empty, so we still got a little bit of overflow. Let's just run across here. Got some loose stuff on the ground. We'd like to find some pre-made food, but rocks are valuable. Yes, you will eventually collect a whole lot of them. Early on, we'll need quite a few. Looks like we're not having much luck here today. Now we got a spring. Oh, there's the gas pump. Now the trick with this, it's broken and we need to repair it. That'll be an early on mission, but until we get these two items, there's no sense investing anything in it until we're ready. Here's the scrapper. Let me show you real quick. We got some moon rock here, not moon rock, meteor ore. Now let's go through and look here. We didn't get much because our thing broke, but this is the best quality, 65. I'm going to stack them. And then I'm going to drag these over. And we'll be able to do this five times. And you can see we're getting all kinds of miscellaneous materials. And this is good stuff to have. Okay. And that was kind of an even exchange. The weight of the rock and the weight of the material kind of evens out from what I could tell. Yeah, I got to start looking for water. Nope, here comes the overheat again. That's going to push us over and kill us. Uh, so let's look around in these buildings. We're looking for barrels. Sometimes they'll be laying on their sides. Okay, there's one there. Let's cross our fingers. That's poison. So no go. Not even gasoline. Oh, there's a wire. We'll take that. I'm looking for some foods, too. There's certain foods. Or if we have enough bugs, let's look in our inventory. We need three bugs... I don't think we've gotten much on bugs, though. No. I thought we just picked up a cricket or something. I'm looking, they're kind of hard to see sometimes. We got one roach. We got some roaches back at the Franks. All right, let's keep going. I'm looking for water. Looking for water barrels. And we may have to go out into the wild. Which is going to be dangerous with the uh, heat. Yeah, see, it's already up in the red, so. And even being inside, it's 55. Yeah, it's not even counting down right now. I think I found, though, this particular style building doesn't seem to be very good. Let's go back into one of the bigger buildings. Let's see if it starts dropping down. Okay, it's 58. 57, here we go. So, because they will start killing our food. Not gonna go down too far though, because it's just extremely hot all outside. Did it go back up again? <laughs> I think it is. Yeah, that could really kill us. What is this here? Wooden stick. I think we already looted this place though. Oh, some stuff comes back. Okay, well, oh, there we go. Cockroach puree. That's a food. Cockroach one, and there's a grasshopper one. The grasshopper one's the better one, but. Beggars can't be choosers. We're going to hold it down. This gives us a little bit of thirst and some food. You see that right there? Got a little bump going. That'll help. Now, one of the things we need to be looking at to help with all this heat problems would be if we can get some more clothing that's heat resistance. We'll go look here. We're not going to probably have the materials right now. We would need three cloth one scrap and a wire. Now the wire is not a problem. In fact, let's clean up house a little bit. 34, 39, 18, 50, 95. Let's see, that rock's 95. I'm grabbing that. That's a good start. And the nuts, 36, 27. So it looks like 36 for now. In our metal plates, we got 267s. Combine those. 40, 70, we'll take the 70. There's an 80, 87, 96, we'll take the 96. And then we've got everything nice and compact. So we only have one cloth. We need three more, two more, I mean. We don't even have any rope. 
And we haven't even been getting nails. Because we need ten nails. Get these planks together. And we needed enough planks. Yeah, we need a bunch of planks still. Okay, the heat's gone down to the yellow. So it's a little safer. Still want to be careful. Try to stay in the shade. We're really crossing our fingers. We need planks, nails. Cloth, rope would be good. Yeah, we already made the backpacks. Oh, there's a rope. Okay. We might be able to get a face mask going here. Let me see how we're doing on, oop, on water. So in this game, nighttime is actually a good time to do a lot of your adventuring. Got another can of food. I hear some, oh, yeah, I thought I heard somebody stomping around. Now, if they get him, I don't have any weapons. Oh, good. So we'll take advantage of that. That there. Another cockroach. No, oh, he didn't have anything. Okay. How you doing? All right. Max Alma. He sells. Okay. He sells food mostly. Yep. And, and he buys a few items back. He buys... Wanderers, leech, electro, let's show you buys eggs. I'm not sure where the eggs come from yet. I hadn't seen any chickens in my hours in the game yet, but I haven't been very far either. Okay. Oh, we're back in the, ooh, we're hurting on the water again. I keep getting out in the sun too long. We're, we're going to have to venture out again. Out into the plains area over there behind us. There can be a good spot. Oh, we just leveled? All right, that's good to know. Yeah, we're going to have to find some water. Pretty desperate. We at least have something to put water in. It doesn't hold much. And what I need to look at... Oh, he almost finished. Yeah. I was about to say what I do need to be looking at, though. See if we can't make, maybe fashion up some kind of weapon. We got a lot of scrap metal on us. Oh, I thought that was a guy. I thought that was one of the uh, low lifes. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we might have enough. We have pipe. Oh, another plank. That's good. Now, usually a good sign that you're overloaded, it'll start putting stuff in your hands, especially if they're empty. And sometimes if you have an item, it'll put that item back in its place and, and fill your hands up. So that's one way to know. Just be careful with that because you could walk around dumping stuff all over the place if you don't pay attention. Okay. Now I'm going to go now and check weapons here. Yep, let's get back in the shade just in case. Let's go to craft. Melee. Okay. Oh, man, we're way off on that. Yeah. Well... Yeah, we're not going to have enough bolts. Bolts are another thing. We only got like one. Uh, I've never tried making a plank weapon. That's still nails we don't have. Yeah, a lot of stuff we don't have. We haven't got lucky yet. Luck is not with us so far. So we're going to get desperate. We got our hammer. Oh, ooh, they just left a supply thing here. Okay, let's grab all this. Oh, there's a grave. These can be good. Those little graves, they can have good stuff in them sometimes. I mean, we're right by Ron in them, aren't we? Or, or am I turned around? I get turned around. Okay, no, Ron and them are over there. Okay, so we're on the opposite side of where we started. Okay. Oh, hang on. You got to keep your ears open. Yep. Uh, maybe I can use my hammer. Oh, oh he fell down. These guys aren't all that athletic. Oh, wow. Oh, now they're throwing crap at me. It's gonna be like before. I can't really fight. These weapons aren't all that great. Now, one thing is to get these guys to beat up each other a little bit. Yeah. I don't know if I'm actually doing anything. 
Okay. Oh, yeah. There we go. Well, I'm just going to keep... Oh, too early. We are out of water. This could be the end. Yeah, if we don't score some water real quick. Uh. Okay, okay. Last one. There we go. Oh, now y'all start shooting. Okay, I'm going to take the claw. Very important. We are getting full, though. Ooh, matches. God, it's very rare. There's the rusty knife we needed. I'm not going to get the stone right now. I seriously want a rope. Another rusty knife. Ooh, man. Do I have room for that plank? Nope. See, it went in my hand. I'm going to put it back in here. Okay. This was a tip uh, uh, that was given to me. These graves, especially if you don't have a lot of uh, a lot of carry space, these stay here for a while, and they're a hundred liters, a hundred kilograms. So you could use these to start piling some stuff up, and then, so let me look around. Okay, so let's go to this one here. I'm gonna drag. Well, let's look real quick. Fifty-five. So we're gonna put that board in there. We have two more planks over here, and I think that'll be good. Then I'm going to walk over here, grab this plank, and I'm going to walk over here. Because there's usually planks. Oh, we got a machete. We definitely want that. Now, see, the plank went in my hand, and it was because of the volume, and there's two of them. Again, I'm going to go over here and drag it into here, and now we've got six planks. But we got to find water. There's like a, a soft campfire down here. So we're going to take that machete. Where did it go? Oh, we got two more planks. Hang on. I, I mess up with the machetes. All, I mean, I can't ever see things. There it is. Go ahead and hit the one key. Assign it. I saw, I saw a campfire. Sometimes there's food and water barrel or water barrels there. And now we got a real weapon. Oop. We, can, we can start fighting a little bit more. Oh, oh, we're, ooh, 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 we're, we're hurting. Hang on. We are hurting. Okay, yeah. Food's down, water's down, everything's down. Okay, take that, take that, take that. I don't think I see anything. No, this is not the right camp. It's not a real camp. Yeah. I'm going to search it just in case we get lucky. No, not the kind of luck we needed. We need a, something with water. Okay, we're not totally uh, screwed yet. We're going to head back to camp with Frank and them. I hope I make it. We're already turning yellow. I don't think I have enough stuff here. I'll check the water one more time. Yeah, it's empty. Okay. So I'm going to empty my hands. I'm going to grab these sticks, uh, boards, put them in my hand. Yeah. Oh, we're losing health. Yeah, we're going to die. Uh, do I have any garlic left? No. No, no garlic. And the canned food won't help. Oh, there's a crate. Look at that. Yeah, we're not going to make it. Uh, I'm going to try to get as close to Frank and them as we can. There's no shame in dying early. We're going insane now. The problem now is that he's going to start running all squirrely. We may lose control of our character. Ooh, somebody dropped something. Oh, that's a set of plans. Maybe, I don't know. We might as well get as close to these guys because there's no water. We only got one match so far. I don't think I have enough time to craft. Where'd it go? 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 I don't know if that's good. Yeah, it was barely. Let's go back, pick up that. I don't know if that'll fit. It did. Let's go to craft. First aid. Oh, we might. Oh, God, I hate when it does this. See, now it's, oh, they're not in the right stacks. We're going to die because stuff's not stacked right. 
Okay, he made it, but I can't find there it is right there. Okay, double click, hold down the mouse button. We're gonna fight it. We're not gonna give up. Okay. It's not gonna last long though, because our thirst is gonna hit us. Okay, but we got health. So we can fight a little bit longer. I wanna go back to this crate real quick. Cause that might be some stuff in there. Oh, look at that. Okay, we got a uh some more bugs. We're gonna see if we can't make some more of that food. And there's something on the ground. Wait, hang on. Oh, oh. Oh, it's water. And there's a second crate. Take all. Take all. There we go. You have to give the take all a second. He's not gonna take that plank. We're full. I don't know if I can double click some of this other stuff. Now it went in our hand. All right, let's run back. Oh, before we go anywhere, where's that Where's that water at? Uh, there it is. Put that in our hand. That means we just threw the can of food on the ground. That's okay. We're going to drink that water. Did I do the empty one? Hang on, because we got no drink out of that that I saw. No? I mean, it, it didn't go up at all. Oh, well. Yeah, we can't carry anything. So let's empty out real quick. We're a little desperate. Not completely. How much stone do we got? Now, I gotta get my inventory. This one was 81, so let's drop that on top. Let's drop those on top. Uh, we don't have any sheet metal in here yet. Okay. It's going to start to get full. It's already at 13. This wood's taking a lot of space. Yeah. Oh, let's uh, combine those. Okay, we got 10. But how are we on nails? We were hurting on nails. Yeah, we only got 44. We'll drop the... Yeah, we only got a couple of nails. But I think we might have... A chance. We got three knives. Okay, okay, cool. We got three rusty knives, so we're gonna. Do we have a little bit of space? Let's run back over here. Get that can of food. Let's see if we can't grab some of this stuff before it disappears. It just throws it on the ground when you can't carry it. Okay, that went in our hands. Will this go anywhere? Let it go in there. That should be it. Okay. Yeah, we're going crazy again. I don't know where to get enough water to get us anywhere. Damn. I don't think we have enough bugs to make any more food. Yeah. Now uh, we need crickets and stuff. Is there a tree nearby? Okay. Let me... Uh, hoof, 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 hoof. Okay, I know what to do. Blueprint. Great. This is our second stash. We can go ahead and F build. We can put stuff in it. And as long as you get a percentage in there, in this case, we want to... Oh, hang on. I think we had another board here. As long as we have about 10% of the materials, it will uh, stay, in, stay in place for us. So I'm going to get this in here. And all we'll be short on are the nails trying to think. I think I can pull this off. Oh, is, is this guy new? He is. Oh, he had nails. Okay. Oh, that's a can of soup. Can of soup. Can of soup. All right. Drag your knife. Right click. That's soup, so it's going to give us a little liquid. Not much. And it'll only give us as much liquid as it can do food. So we didn't finish it, but we're going to keep it with us. And I threw something on the ground. Oh, the plank. Okay, so we got to get the can out of our hand. It doesn't know where to put it because well, we have no space again. All right. And we just dropped that. Let's talk to Frank. Sorry, I'm kind of babbling. Okay, it's actually a really nice knife, but it doesn't do much damage. It had some nice stats, but we need these nails. 
And we just leveled again. Let's give him those rusty knives. Let's see if that gave us enough space. Nope, still not. Okay. Let's finish this. Because we should now have more than enough nails. I think. Oh, maybe not. He only gave us two nails. No! Oh! oh! <laughs> I mean, I might as well just let the guy kill me. I think Ron's broke. He's stuck on something. Okay, let me try to get over here. Get those last two nails in there. Okay. I don't know who won that fight. I'm kind of in a disadvantage where I don't have time to put stuff in properly. This early in game, I'm just going to have to deal with some of the stuff being lesser quality. We need inventory space. And we got to get some water big time. And we do have some garlic there. And we're probably going to fill this thing up. We're going to keep all the little rodents and stuff. I'm sorry, bugs. Okay. We should have enough material now to build a few things. But let's just get everything. We got two knives. Ooh, what is it? No, two knives. Okay. Uh, almost done. Ammo. Uh, put that away. I'll keep food with us for now. Okay. We're going with trees. The trees have a chance to have bugs. Now, where do we get a flashlight from? Oh, I didn't see that before. Did I unlock something? Oh, maybe when I made the crate. When I made the crate, it unlocked the uh, flashlight. That explains it. I get one every game and I don't ever pay attention. We may need the uh, splash screen. Oh, that's locked. Okay. So that you have to have a key from a boss, which apparently maybe. Oh, that might have been who he killed. No, we didn't get a key off of him. All right. We're going to go here. We're going to pray that we get lots of bugs, preferably grasshoppers, but oh, we're getting resin. Well, the bugs aren't going to help us because we're not hungry. Okay, I'm just going to hold this down for a few minutes. It is getting dark, though. So if we could just score a little water from somebody. I'm just going to have to look around, see if there's any little camps. Keep our knife ready. Now that's a bandit container. Those guys can be very bad for us. If there's any here. Always keep an eye out for bodies. Because sometimes they'll they'll fight amongst themselves and leave you some loot. This is probably a vendor out in the middle of nowhere, but that's okay because sometimes they can have the it's not even a vendor. Let's cross our fingers, it's not poison or oil. It's oil, okay. Sometimes those can be random. So we can't build the water condenser. We need, oh crap. We need three matches. We only found one so far. I really should double check that recipe, but I'm pretty sure if I remember, it was three matches or box of matches. How close is this guy? There's a whole bunch of... Come on, guys. I want to search, but... Yeah, I'm tired, too. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have time, you guys. Come on. Biggest thing is keep our health up. Try to get these guys worn down. Oh, man. Because I don't have any bandages. So what you're hearing there is they're hitting each other. Nope, I'm out of stamina. Hang on. Oh, 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 oh. Don't let it get completely out. Let's KO that guy. That guy should be ready to go. Come on. Man, he's tough. No, oh, that was too tough. We both ran out. Uh, take it all for now. Oh, come on, another guy. can stand your ground a little bit. He 
You just gotta make sure you're fast enough. There we go. Yeah, you can't stand your ground. We just don't have any defensive moves just yet. Okay. We're getting desperate again. Some more rusty knives. I don't think I got all these guys. It'll tell you, though. If you haven't searched them, then it'll say search. Otherwise, it'll say search again. Okay, I saw some stuff in here. Grasshopper puree. Oh, come on. No, no. Right. Too fast. Let him finish. I don't know if this will work, though, because we are not hurting on... Oh, that's good. Okay. Yeah, we're just going to be scraping by. Scraping by. Well, this should show anybody has been following that my first couple of playthroughs, I was just kind of looking. Well, the first playthrough, I did die quite a bit. Uh, I wasn't having a lot of luck with water either. Second playthrough, we started off really good. I mean, we had the snail wagon, a vehicle, really fast, up front, and a bunch of stuff like that. But this one's a lot more survivalist. We are fighting for every drop we can get. That's why I'm trying to get bugs. Grasshoppers, preferably. It's three, three grasshoppers, a cloth, and a stone to make the puree. What was that? Wooden sticks? Okay. Now, usually if there's a whole congregation of them, they might be guarding something. Let's go back to our knife. Oh, he's not having much luck. Now, this weapon's only... Look at that. It's not, not much left for it, so it reduces the damage. Hang on. Quite a bit. Oh, 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 hang on, I'm getting, I'm starting to bite off more than I can chew. We're going to have to do some running gun. Yeah, because they hit us with a, oh, man, is that a bone crusher? No. There's a bone crusher, he's a little bit bigger than these guys. Oh, he wasn't, oh, I'm, oh, no, 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 okay. No more fighting for mad. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to use up all my water. Uh, we're too tired to fight, and we're lost. Okay, let's pull the map back. Okay. Well, we're still not having any luck with the water. Now we got guys throwing rocks at us. And I don't know if I have enough material to make a uh, puree. Let's see if they'll give up if I run over enough. Okay, it's starting to get dark. 1800. Maybe a little sunset happening. I'm taking the scenic route. So I think maybe now Ron and them used to be a uh, 3D. Let's see. Okay, so it's turned. Okay. Maybe not. I thought they were right there. Okay, well, we'll see. I'm not seeing them pop up on the map like they used to. Used to be able to see them from far away, I thought. Well, how's our weight overall? Okay, we're just carrying a little bit of garbage. I mean, uh, salvage. Oh, great. Well, this will be a better way to go than... Dying of thirst, at least. <laughs> I don't think we have achievements yet, so. <laughs> what about the whole lightning strikes twice? Am I okay if I stand right here? Okay, we've got a loner over there. We're looking for barrels in the distance. The plains areas like this are really good for that being able to see stuff. Yeah, we haven't come across any campsites either. I don't need you guys to drink water. Doesn't have to be all that great. Oh, he's got friends coming. 
Oh, luckily his friend's not too coordinated. Okay, he's down. Come on, buddy. Oh, is he ready? He's ready to go down. Oh, no. Second win. Second win. I don't want any more of your friends. Come on, I gotta get water. Taking too long. Oh, jeez. Yeah, he didn't have anything anyway. Uh. Oh, I leveled up again. And I skipped that last level, didn't I? Man, I can't even hit the guy now. Oof. Yeah, we're missing. Oh, we're out of, uh... Yeah, we're out of stamina. Jeez. Yeah, you gotta maintain your, your tools and weapons, otherwise you get this situation where you can't even kill a guy. Now I know, hang on. Okay. Oh, I just switched it back, and now we got a, we got another guy. Hang on, let me switch. I think that's it. Yeah, his one's a little better. Oh, that's a bone crusher. That's the last thing we needed. We're going insane. We've got no bandages. And we can't hit. <laughs> and all I wanted to do was loot that box. Never surrender. You're going to have to kill me, my friend, because I can't give up. Yeah, this one I won't stand up. He has a really... Yeah, right there. Boom. Yeah. Because he hits pretty good. I'm trying to wear him down. Same thing as the other guys. Swing just a little early like that. And you can get a cut of right in the stomach. Oh, come on. Don't tell me I'm attracting his friends. Get over here. She's tough. Oh, that hurt. Golly. He's starting to wear down. Oh, he got us good. Yeah, we're toast. And now here comes another guy. Oh, now you get winded. Let me see if I can get him winded. Oh, now I'm winded. Oh, now we're dead. Yeah, we're toast. bleed out. We're gonna bleed out. I don't think I have anything I can do. No. Well, we fought it. Oh, we ended up in town. Hey. So now we'll have a map marker. Now what I'm curious about is if I go here, click on that one. Can I do 3D? There it goes. Okay, that worked. Okay. I think the Frank and Ron one, because normally it's default that it's already set, so maybe it, that's why it didn't spawn. We confused it. I'm looking to see if there's anything. Now, nah, let's go to our body. Because now we have a little water. We got food. We got food on our body. It was inevitable. Ugh. Hate to die, but there was just nothing I could do. Now we gotta hope these guys aren't camping us too long. Cause the only thing you retain. Oh, okay. We, oh, never mind. We kept the good stuff. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, that's actually a decent. It needs to be sharpened. Let's go ahead and put that in the number one slot. And let's go to crafting. Let me see under tools. I don't think we'd have the material, though. We got a hammer. But we don't have any nails. Or a stone. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that way that we can make a whetstone and then we can sharpen this knife. 
But what we got to get back is our pack. We dropped our backpack and we dropped our... Oh, here he comes. And this guy's going to come. So what I got to try to do... No, 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 no. Don't pick it up. Yeah, we're back to this. Well, I don't have a knife. Where am I hearing more steps? Uh, we're going to be right back in the same boat. If I can't get these guys down. Did they get their health back? No, he's ready to go down. Yeah, he's ready. Come on, come on, come on. Don't let him get his wind. Come on. Down. This guy. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Oh, good, he's down. All right, so what we want to do is we want to go to that second wheel. So we put the stuff on, because otherwise you can try to stick it in your inventory. And if it's a backpack, you'll be told you can't carry. So let's go back to map. And click that icon. And I think we can remove it all together. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now well, nothing big, still nothing to drink. Well, do have a little bit of uh, some more food items. Now, the whole thing was I wanted to loot some crates. That's a meteor. Well, I got so far away. Where was the stuff he was guarding? Is that all the way down here? Yeah, I guess we started over here. Yeah, I got some bolts. Sometimes I just double click, it's faster. And that's a water well there, but it's broken. It needs to be repaired, and that's not a good spot. Yeah, not really gonna try to put too much effort in that. Cause we don't have the parts anyway. There are a lot of people out here. Yeah, I see you guys. I'm gonna hunt for some barrels because we have two containers. They're small, but we could put we could get some water in them. Now, see that smoke over there in the distance? That's a down transport vehicle. Might even be able to uh, loot it for some materials, but. Oh, well, I got three guys coming. Come on. Oh, oh. Is that? Oh, that's another bone crusher. Man, I'm having no luck today. Okay, I gotta, I gotta get up here a little bit. And let's run towards the weak guy. Okay, get him out of the way. Gotta get the weaker ones. Okay, hop along there. See, now that I got my speed, a little energy back, I can do those running strikes. Oh, I missed him. Oh, and he slowed me down. Yeah, he's catching me a little bit when I run by. God, I want the weak guy. Get him out of the way. I'm going to use up all my water chasing these guys around in circles. Uh. Oh, he got me again. Oh, we're going to be stuck in a death loop here. Come on. I don't know if I can make a band. Oh, no, don't do that. Hang on. Let me run this way for a little bit. Now, if we, we don't have any, yeah, we don't have enough material. Okay, hang on. Let's get this guy here. Man, he's tough. Now, another one came. Problem is this this knife is so bad. Both of our knives are bad. Yeah, he's out of the way. <laughs> and our health our food is running out. Oh, he's gonna get us. Yeah. We're toast. Alright guys. Well uh, I don't know what to do. I can't get to any loot. Uh, I'm gonna head back to town. We're just going to have to stick to town for a little while. We're not ready for this. i got to get our weapons beefed up. 
check our inventory. But water's just going to be a big problem right now. I probably can't even carry all this. Come on. Okay. Oh, look at that. Now, the problem is I'm probably bleeding out. Oh, I didn't even check it ahead of time. I hope it's water. <laughs> okay. Now we're going to look for a can of food. Any knife, open that up. And we want to chow this down a little bit. Okay, then we want to grab a garlic. Because I think the garlic speeds up healing. Some kind of a miracle drug. Maybe not, though. Look at it. It's dying. Is it going up or not? Crap. Is this water? Dirty water, 0.36. Go to 4. And fill it in. Okay. Uh, so do we not have cloth? Why can't we make bandages? We've got a garlic. I've literally picked up no cloth. I got a stone. Okay. So we go to material. Cloth, craft. Go back to first uh, first aid, bandage. Uh, of course, the cloth is stacked too high. Or we don't have enough. No, 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 no. It's got to be five cloth. Where's the fifth one? Branch one off. There we go. Okay, now we got the bandage. And we'll just double click it, hold it down. Okay. Now we're gonna go back, craft, tools, whetstone, craft. Oh, we at least got one. Oh, there was a transport. Okay, we're gonna get our knife in our hand. This is the better one of the bear. So this one has a prefix or a suffix on it. And so it is plus 20 damage. So we're gonna get our whetstone, which is 38. So it wasn't that great, but that's all we got. Right click, drop on there. So at least we got it up uh, 63%. Let's go back into, what are we missing here? Probably nails. We had a hammer. We obviously had a hammer somewhere. We got the hammer. We got stone. Yes, yeah, so we're out of nails again. Okay. And let me check this one more time. I think it's empty. Yeah, it's empty. Okay. Well, at least we can fight a little more. Maybe I can go get some revenge on some of these guys. I need to head to town, though. Am I even going the right way? Yeah, there we go. We should take out some guys. They may drop something we want. At least now we should be a little better off. Okay. Oh, yeah. And I do need to check our inventory. Or not inventory. Oh, what would you do that for? Yeah, we can't afford that. We need our knife in our hands. Okay, we're right here out of town. Let's get into town. 4.7, 2.3. Okay, we got the nails. Got the bolt. Got the spring. Got the rust. That plate's going to put us over. No, it didn't. So again, it was just volume. Okay, we survived-ish. We're going to go into town. Actually, we're going to head. go ahead and head back to uh, Ron and Frank. So let me try this again. They're not popping up. It should be right over there. Maybe we need to report that to the devs. It doesn't actually stop. Oh, I see it's not staying. Okay. Well, we'll try to remember to report that if they see the video or if one of you guys see the video. Oh, look at this. And it's going to take. Okay. We're gonna come right back. I told you these it was 
grave sites can be really good. So let's get back to Ron and Frank's. We got our crate and our little hole in the ground. Let's unload. Let's grab that plastic bottle. Even if it doesn't have water in it, it's a big score. Because it allows us to carry two liters and collect two liters if we find a good source of water. So for now, it's going to be a mess. I'm just going to be throwing everything in there. Did we get a second set of matches? No. Oh, we'll check our other crate. Let's get everything out of here that's not stuff we're using or selling. Uh, I can sell those for bolts, but for now, let's just keep them as food. Because this is a crate. It's good for 60. Yeah, 60. So we can really put everything in here for now. And we'll worry about getting more efficient with our conditioning. We have a little more time to work on things. I'm just going to stack it all up. Then I can start looking at what we can craft in bulk. Oh, what do we get there? Big stone stash. Okay. That lets us make a 60 similar size to this crate. And what did I do? There's not much left on there, but let's hold on to that. Okay. I think we're down to just tradables. Let's double check here. Did I throw anything? And then I want to check in here. Now, I may leave this alone because some of this stuff is in good condition. So let's not muck it up right now. Okay. So let's open this up. And go to craft. Whetstone. Craft. And right click over here. There we go. So we're going to get the most damage. 20 to 35. Plus 4, seven, four to 7 additional damage. All All right. Uh, let's see, what else should we be worrying about? Can we make any more bandages? Surprisingly, no. Is it cloth? I know we got cloth. It's going to be the food stuff. So let's go over here. We do have a garlic. Let's get our roaches. Let me look here. Yeah, the rest of this I'm going to try to keep clean. So let's go back in here. I got to get back to that grave, I know. I won't forget. I just want to see if I can make a bandage because that's very important and then we want to go to equipment we don't need that just trying to see about that what are we missing we got that we got that so we out of cloth again let me look yeah we're out of cloth again okay not a big deal it's still nighttime let's run back over to the grave we need to take advantage of the night. We can get the most use out of our water. Now, did I already drain this one or did I not get back to it? Let's see. I think I drained that one, yeah. Those will eventually disappear. I don't know about multiplayer versus single player. So far, what I've seen in the single players, they whenever I read, you know, log out and log in for my next game, some of that stuff moves around or disappears. And gets replaced. Okay. I'm saving the best for last here. Let's see. Poison. Okay. Not a bad thing. What we're going to do now, we're going to right click this, drag it to our knife. Boom. And that one's for all the community members that kept yelling at me poison your weapons. And I just keep forgetting. All right. Let's check this junk pile here. And we're going to go out that way. I see some more graves. Those might be the ones we already did. Yeah, we already did all this. Okay. And we already went over there. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm remembering. And I did a pretty good job on town. I know I didn't finish, but... Oh, here we go. There's a water barrel. I can see it from here. There might even be a fuel barrel or a crate. These are the little campsite. These are pretty cool. And it's got a bed, which doesn't matter now. But you can use this if you need to to sleep. So let's check this guy out. Okay, 0.75. So what we're going to do, though, let's go into our inventory. So obviously, I'd rather have the big bottle be full of water. It's got 0.64 uh, poison in it. But what we're going to do is we've got two flasks. That one's still got a little dirty water in it. 
So this one I'm going to put in my hand. I'm going to right click, drag, drop that. Now, it didn't take it all because obviously there was more there, but this will be enough for what we're going to need. But don't do that. Oh, I did it anyway. That's how I drop stuff all the time. I should have just hit the G key and cleared my hand. Okay, back to inventory. So what we want to do is we want to put this in our hand, or I could have swapped the items. And we're going to go to where it says mouse pour out, hold down the button. And now it's empty. Go over here, fill. And now we got points fit five seven. And then just for just to make things better, easier, I'm going to go back into inventory. And we're gonna take the other canister of dirty water. There we got point eight seven. That way it's all in one place and we have an empty container in case we need it that's probably going to be fuel obviously well no it probably will be sometimes they switch them up though the idea being that either someone's trying to trick you or they just that's what they you know they just put something else in it all right let's keep walking around get our knife back in our hands we're going to pick on some oh, is that another tent whoa whoa did he just come out of nowhere and out of that tree? I mean, there's a water barrel right there. I just saw it. Hang on. Hang on. I gotta, I'm too slow. Here we go. All right. Oh, good. Let's check that water here in a second. Now, you can mix liquid, so be careful. Uh, so if you have dirty water in a container and you put clean in it, it'll be dirty. So the, I guess the worst case go is takes the control, I guess you'd say. So let's look and see. Okay, that's dirty water, so that's fine. So we're going to go back to inventory. I'm going to switch this for four. Hotkey four, so I can get to it faster. And because I always forget, bandage goes to three. And we'll put the hammer on two. Okay, good. Four, and we already checked it, so we'll just say fill. And that'll probably put us at two, right? Yeah. And there's probably stuff left in there. We'll double check. No, it's empty. It was exactly what we needed. Okay. Now, the thing is, there's another barrel there. Let's get our thing here. Oh, whoa. Oh. Oh. Yeah, these guys are real friendly. There we go. The other guys don't seem like they're all that interested in helping their friend out. Pick up those rusty knives. Those are good trade. Come on, buddy. So the rusty knife gets us nails. And the bone knives get us a wire from Ron. Okay, we should finish these guys first. Yeah, there we go. Oh, he was... Oh, they're bleeding, yeah. He, or he was poisoned. Okay. So the way the poison wears off your weapon is from the uh, usage every time you use it. Otherwise, it retains it, even if it's in your bag. And again, all this comes from my uh, information I'm getting fed from the community. So definitely check the comments in the videos. Uh, there's a lot of stuff being put in there from fellow players. 0.96. See, now we're in that situation where... Uh, let's go ahead and fill this one. It won't be much, but... It'll be better than nothing. And then what we're going to do now is we're pretty healthy right now. So let's switch back to our knife. And then I'm going to just drink right out of here. Top off our thirst. Take a little poison. That's okay. When you're full health, it's not bad. And we might as well get as much out of this as we can. Okay, there we go. Let's go over here. I saw something... Something caught my eye, and I don't remember what. Wait a minute. I saw something. I thought I saw something. Maybe not. Might have been that bush. I think it might have looked like a box from back there. It was light colored. Okay, yeah, we checked all these guys. Yeah, I thought I saw something. That's okay. That's, yeah, there's another barrel. Unless I got, did I get turned around again? 
I get flipped around a lot. Let's see. Oh, no, more water. Man. Oh, there. Okay, there's a junk pile. All right, we're starting to gain a little ground on stuff. Nope, too soon, too soon. Oh, you can't bump into them, so watch out. That's what happened to me and that uh, other guy earlier. I kept hitting him just enough to where he was slowing me down. Okay, he's good, he's good. There you go. You can see all the poison damage. Taken away. Oop, too, oh. He's not liking that. Oh, he got a, he got a little... Uh-oh, uh-oh. Stand our ground. All right. Check the first one here. We st yeah, we're getting planks. we got to be careful. Ooh, glass. That's good. Need a couple pieces. We can make some goggles. Yeah, there we go. I was afraid that was going to happen. So what I want to do here, that's 35. That's 27. 61. 48. Oh, someone's coming. Hang on. All right, we're going to leave those here for a second. Got to remember which body, the closest body to the... Oh, that's a bone crusher. Damn. I need to get a ranged weapon pretty soon. And sometimes he'll get that last second stab on you. Oh, the poison ran off. Uh, just in time. Hang on. Uh, what I like another thing about this game. She can do stuff on the run. Oh, I missed him. I was trying to get a little poison stab on him. There we go. Here, take that. So I was stacking those boards because what I want to do is it'll be easier if they're all in one pile that we can carry them and drop them as we need to. Because they are very valuable. I hate leaving any of those behind. He's, he's, yeah, it looks like his health is almost... They need to make the health bars a little thicker, I think. Just a little more so you can see him a little farther back. Okay. I'm going to stop picking up bones and sticks for a little while and stones. Is that a barrel? We already checked. We haven't checked this yet. Yeah, because we, we're, we're going to prioritize stuff like that. Those metal sheets. So we'll go back in here. If I drop that on here, we'll be okay because our knife already had a home. And what we're going to do now is check our map. Ron and Frank are over here. So roughly, so, so far we've noticed on the map that Ron and Frank don't show up on the 3D. Is that another water barrel? Well, it won't matter. We just need to remember. I'm just going to do this. I hope that guy didn't come over here. And I'm going to type in water barrels in case they're still here. I think that's it. You could do a color. I guess I could type like blue. And let's see if that works. Look at that. Cool. All right. Yeah, because there was two or three barrels there. Now we'll be coming up on. Oh, we still got some time. Yep. Yeah. Let's head back to base. Back to Ron and Frank's shack. So I'm going to be putting my initial inventory there. Okay, so what I want to do... I don't think I have a way to... Hmm. That's the only thing I can't do is stack. Once I've got a stack. Yeah. We'd have to have something to set them in. Oh, now I just dropped those on the ground. Yeah, I can't combine them. I'm looking around. Is it worth it? Hang on. Is this uh, something we've already searched? Okay. Put those there. 
I know it seems silly, but man, those planks are real hard to find. Metal pipes was something also I've run into problems when you start building, when I was building uh, certain items. Storage units and some of the building things I was building. I ran out of planks. I mean, a uh, pipe real fast. Okay. Yeah, because we need 10 of these to make another storage container. So what I was getting at is we'll leave that storage over there by franking them for now until we kind of get settled in. It'll give us a place where we can kind of keep a lot of stuff until I can figure out um, where we want to build. Do I want to build over here again? This town's okay. It was attractive because it has a, a repairable field pump and it has the grinder, the shredder. But uh, that's it. It only has three, I think only three vendors. Three, maybe four vendors. So we may look for a little more populated area we can move in, you know, closer to a bigger town. And it's nice being near Frank and them. Oh, another plank. So we're going to do this, because I think if we have this and another box, or no, you know what we should do? Hang on, let me see. How many stone do we have? Okay, we only got five, because the stone one would be cheaper. 18. So I'm going to put my planks on the ground. They go to your feet when you drop them. Okay. And let's go to blueprints. Oh, we didn't learn that blueprint yet. Did I put it away? No, here it is. Put that in our hands. Hold that down. And I do know I got two levels of points to spend. I'll get that in just a second, too. Okay, let's get this bigger stash. It's 30 stone. I'm going to turn it like that. Kind of set it right here against the back of the building. Because... I'd rather save those planks as much as we can. So we're just going to drag any stone we have in. Scroll up and down. We're good so far. Check in here. Grab those 18. And so once we have at least 10% of the material in there, it should stay for a while. I even logged out and logged back in on my save. So let's go to... We had a pickaxe at one time it is busted up but we have this a little bit of a little bit of usage on it I don't know if it'll be enough but let's see we'll just keep banging until either the rock runs out or it does and I don't know if they base the quantity on the size of the stone as how much you get because it is on the trees the bigger the tree the more uh, loot I got or loot opportunities I should say yeah, okay, it stopped on three. And I'm looking, there's another rock over there by those trees. Let's just see how far we are. Yeah, we need, yeah, we're going to need some more. And I think that was all we had stashed. So we need four more. There was none there. Okay. Right, let me see, is there room in here? 23 liters. So let's see, I doubt these are going to be like... Oh, we got to put that. Uh, we got to free our hands up. Okay. So let's go and look right here. It'll tell us the size. Yes, nine liters. We could try. Oh, it does fit. Okay. Make sure. To, yeah, see, it fell on the ground. I'm, I'm having a thing. So again, what was I? Okay, what was I told? Scroll to the bottom and drag here to the next open area. Now, what I've been doing was dropping it on wherever it turned green over here, too, on the, on the bar. And just let it fall where it fit, wherever it would. Okay, let's get that plank. All right. That in there, that'll probably be... It'll say, no, no room. Whoa. There's, oh, there's three more here. Hang on. So let's... Middle mouse. So we got 12. That's 55, 50, so we double click, 14. Another thing that happened to me a few times, uh, I'd put some stuff in here, like, and it didn't show up, but the people were like, and when they were watching the video, oh, but you had, the weight was showing. So someone said, oh, if that happens, 
try you know, log out, log back in, especially like a single player, see if it uh, shows up. Okay, let's check matches. We got one there. Was there one over here too? No, we only got one match. Okay. I ended up having to buy them in my other two playthroughs test. I didn't get lucky in the... Uh... Oh, what am I doing? Hang on. Oh, we don't need stone. Uh, I didn't plan that out very well. Uh, yeah, I don't know how many stone now. <laughs> we can't make a, uh, can't repair the pickaxe. We can't make a whetstone without some stone, obviously. Well, let's go poke around. We've been out here, but let's poke around a little bit. Let's see if there's anybody out here. We can maybe score couple of rocks off some low lives if they want to get in a fight you know, if we get keys so that's what this is that like that uh, one box I couldn't open these are uh, bandit storage key facilities and it'll tell you it's locked you'll get keys off of certain kills usually the more boss or tankier guys yeah I haven't oh, I didn't finish looting your place let's go ahead and blank I probably should have made sure I emptied what I emptied more stuff, but I wasn't planning on looting. Oh, this one's a, a bot. How you doing, Echo? Something, something. We're just uh, perusing your inventory, Echo Tom. Okay, Echo Tom. There we go. Okay, we got a rock. Two. Okay. So what I want to do is make, try to make a. Uh, Stone, so we can sharpen that pickaxe and then we'll go hit a boulder and try to get about 10 more boulders just to have a, a good stash finish off that stash house stash box okay and I always want to check and see what these guys do okay he sells a couple of weapons he buys goggles sell or buys hats sells a crossbow some face mask. He buys. Okay, he buys the uh, old bags for a good price. And what is that? One gallon pouch. Oh, he buys them. And the snail wagon. That's my favorite ride so far. I haven't seen one yet. I guess I'm gonna lose my streak. So far, every playthrough, I found a snail wagon in the first episode. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, sorry. A little poison for you. Yeah, and thanks for pointing that out, guys. I'm, I'm not forgetting, but I am forgetting names. I just don't write anything down, because usually I do this stuff when I'm at work. I'll check my messages. to keep. I like to keep up on them. And then at night when I get home, I go over straight into game mode. So I'll try to get better at that. Be able to do shout-outs to you guys. Channel's new. I only started it at the end of January of this year, so this is only my second, well, well this is my second playthrough of a game, long series. We did a little bit of uh, one-offs here and there in a couple games. I tried to do Icarus, but it just didn't, didn't seem to work for me or the channel. <laughs> we weren't getting any views on it, so, but anyway. I'm really having fun with this one, which helps. Is that a town over there? Just some more shacks. It's 1.41 in the morning. We're usually good to about 6 or 7 a.m. So what we came out here to do, which I got distracted from, is get some stone off a of rock. So let's go back to craft, tools. What are we missing? We haven't gotten any nails. Damn, no nails. I could make nails, but I don't even have enough material for that. All right, well, we're not gonna be getting anything. Now, oh, 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 golly, I totally forgot. Poof. All right, uh, scavenger. Take you to 30, and then we're gonna start working on some other stuff. Um, I know so we got here passive regeneration and increases the effectiveness of all healing items. So we're going to do five points. Architect, I want to start slowly putting it in there for now. 
we're gonna be a little ways off. Oh. Okay, I put more than I wanted. Uh, I want to do five. That's okay. And then I want to start because we do a lot of melee fighting. Well, this says may. Okay. Awake is a problem that amplifies weapon damage of all types. Why did I say melee? You know, there's nothing about melee in here. Okay. Well, we'll go ahead and start beefing up our melee damage. Okay. And what I was saying, I was going to check these trees because sometimes I get odd stuff out of the trees. I have gotten nails and wire before. So let's just take a gamble. Maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, and the grasshoppers, that's good. Yeah, I haven't farmed a lot of trees in the past. I just on occasionally when I ran out of sticks, I'd go look. But I did notice I was getting stuff like rusty nuts and kind of like there's like a hole in the tree maybe and someone's hiding some other stuff. A little hidey hole. Okay, we got a victim up there. Yeah, we're definitely getting a lot of sticks out of this. Another grasshopper, that's good. And he's got another barrel. Man, there's, they're everywhere now. <laughs> now that we can't do, take advantage of them. Whoa, 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 watch out. That should be it for him. Okay, let's check. The big score will be if we start finding some uh, clean water. Okay, I'll take the rocks. I'm still holding off on bone. I'm just going by my last playthroughs. Whoa! That was a bone crusher too, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, I missed him. Totally whiffed him. Oh, almost got too close. I go after these guys because I don't know if they drop keys, but they usually can drop some pretty good, some pretty good stuff. But I've seen bone crusher stashes, so that's why I think you may occasionally find one of these guys, who's a more of a boss version of them. Okay, I'm trying to see that poison. Is it saying point? Oh, it says point eight. Okay, there you go, buddy. We do need to get back to town. We need to start picking up some quests. I got a roach. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so let's start heading back. Oh, we got a big stash pile here of junk. Good chance for nails. Yeah. Mm. Oh, missed him on that one. Okay. All right, another board. Okay. Ah, no nails. Okay. Saw blades are good too. Call them saw blades. Okay, let me see if I can. I'm getting better. I know that's the mountain right there that we build by. I have kept the same map for these last three playthroughs. Well, the first two playthroughs. Or the first, I guess I'll call it my second little playthrough. That was the same map twice, but I only did two episodes when I restarted. So I still haven't explored the map. I just kind of know the general area, but I still didn't get very far. Uh oh. I have heard you can die from this, so why I kind of worry you know like look see how close they are Ooh. oh they hit that car see that it hit that transport oh crap yeah that's good. keep your eyes open there's Ron and Afra not Ron yeah Ron and Frank's so we got another ga uh, match. So we're down to one matchbook or butt box of matches. Let me show you what I'm talking about here. So we go to fix, build. Oh, it was two. Okay. Okay, we can start. We can start working on this then. Uh, nails. We might be able to buy some. So let's start with some easy stuff. Sticks. Come on, I know I was picking up sticks earlier. There we go. Sticks. 
match. And this is just going to give us the ability to have a place to go to when we need to and have some dirty water and know it's here. Uh, well, technical drag. Oh, no, I have a bad hammer somewhere. Let's keep the good one. Uh, nails are going to be a little bit of a problem. Well, yeah, that'll be a problem. We didn't have any nails. And, but we got some rusty knives. And then we're missing... Oh, saw blades, saw blades. We picked one up earlier. No, that's a pipe. Hang on. That's a metal pipe. Oh, here we go. Two saw blades. And so let's go check our inventories for bolts. Let's talk to our buddy, Ron. Did he disappear again? I lost him one time. We never did get... Oh, do we get enough rocks? I'm all over the place, guys. Sorry. We did. I'll forget about that. Now we got a nice big stash hole. Okay, that's as good as the box. I didn't want to build any more boxes just because of the planks. I just built the first one for the quest. We can tear them down, but uh, as far as I know, at least at this time, we don't get material back. So it's more of just to keep the uh, apocalyptic world clean, clean up after yourself kind of thing. Okay, so how many nails did we get? Eight. We're still going to be short, I believe. But we'll check our inventory. We might have that. Uh, that's it for now. We don't need bone nails. Yeah, we do have some bone knives. Hang on. We didn't get a lot that time around. We actually got more rusty stuff than we did. Okay. So let's go check in here. I think what we're going to be short on will be bolts and nails. And we only got one bolt there. Let's put some of these nuts in here. I don't need them on me at the moment. Uh, what else was in there? I think we had all old plastic sheets. And plastic scrap. The other, oh, there's some more nails. Do we have any bolts? So bolts might be hurting us. But we have access to bolts. Yeah, we have uh, dog food. <laughs> Whatever reason, he, I think it's supposed to be the... Oh, so I think it's empty cans in general. But we'll see here. Uh, let's see. So we start off... Oh, we needed the... Uh, dang it. Okay, we'll start with the plastic. We had eight plastic sheets. Uh, bolts. Looks like we have four so far. I just bought a bunch of nails. Okay. I'm probably not seeing everything. But the bolts will go... So we only need six more bolts. I think that's two cans of dog food. So let me go check real quick. And we need the hammer, right? Thought I had a broken hammer somewhere, but let me look at the dog food. That one's been opened. That's closed, that's closed. I was looking to see if I had an empty already. Oh, we needed these. Now we don't have one. Oh, here. And let's look in here real quick. Did we need 10 of these? I think we did. Yeah, they're just too heavy. Oh, wait, here we go. Oh, that's our backpack. Oh, uh, what a mess, guys. Let's go work with this. Yeah, let's go work with that. I think we're going to need plastic. Yeah, oh, it was only eight. Okay. So, oh, that's full. And I just threw it on the ground. Okay. Uh, nails and bolts. Bolts, bolts, bolts. Ron, my friend. And anyway, you could just spare me a... I need one more knife. Okay, we get three each here. So we'll give him... Is this one... Hang on. Let me go ahead and chop down on that. Try to finish that off. I don't... See, I don't know if he's just specifically just buying cans to recycle. No, it says canned dog food. Okay. Well, two of these... We, oh, I don't have the rest of them in the thing. Yeah. That'll get us our bolts for now. It's all about bartering and trading. 
Man, I can't carry anything. And then we'll just be down to plastic. Man, well, he moves fast. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, then we'll just be down to, I think, just the plastic. Yeah, I was worried about the matches. And I actually got them this time. Here they are. And put that over there. What am I missing, guys? It was the bolts that I just bought. And there should have been two of them. Okay. What's, yeah, that's, oh, the hammer. Well, we'll just use this one. Okay, I might have used the other one for building something else that I just forgot. Yeah, so we're down to two sheets of plastic and two nails. Okay. So let's put some stuff away. Like I said, I'm just kind of just piling it up for now. Oh, wrong one. Keep the weapons. Food. Well, this is a 60, so I'm going to try to put most of our stuff in here because it, it'll make it... Oh, we got more nails. Do we need nails? No, plastic. Yeah, plastic. Okay. Planks, 15. 16. Okay, we're looking good there. I'll put the bone in there. We're still good. Okay. Yeah, and, the, and what I'm saying is, the reason I'm saying to keep everything together right now is it makes it easy to craft early on. Just put all of our good stuff in one place as long as it'll fit. So we actually don't have a whole lot. We're not doing bad. Yeah, I see three crickets. I see some roaches. Let's go in here. Let's go ahead and grab this stuff. Uh, take all. I always forget. Make it easy. Okay. And we'll go back in here. Yeah, it'll make it easier for us to craft in the beginning. We're just going to put everything in one place. We don't need ammo until we have some firearms. We want to maximize our carry. We'll leave the food in there. Okay. Oh, yeah, put that away. That's really... I just need to get rid of that. Okay, flashlight. Put you up here. Okay, broken tools. Flashlight, water. Bandages. Did one of these have... Okay, that still has some, a little bit of poison left. I'm trying to put everything in our... Well, backpack's not the right place. So when you die, only your pocket's in your backpack survive i mean i'm sorry only your pockets and your in your pants and your shirt survive so i'm gonna try to put this stuff like this yeah the more valuable stuff i don't think that yeah that way if we die we have the good stuff here it's food water whatever all right let's finish this off it seems like that last 10 grams doesn't really do anything for us Okay, so we're still hurting on the same thing. Plastic. And bolt. No. Yeah, no. Oh, it was nailed. That ah, dang it. <laughs> well, we got that. Okay. Number, 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 nails. So it's just the plastic. And just a couple of people. What is that? Oh, it's a locked storage. What the heck? I haven't found any keys. Okay. Let's see how it is. Nails. Poof. Too plastic. Okay. Let's poke around. How are we doing on time? We're doing all right. I'll probably cap this one. Well, we'll see. I've been doing between two and three hours. Just kind of however the flow goes for that particular episode. Oh, 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 oh. We moved everything around, so we've lost our assignments. Uh, that's four. Bandage is three. And the pickaxe was two, but we really don't need it right now. 
You know, I put the flashlight in there. I never use it, but... Yeah, because we just need some plastic. Maybe we'll get lucky. Some guys here will have something on them. I don't know if these are... These may be things we've already searched. So it'll be rare to get plastic off a kill. Yeah. But I'm going to start keeping rocks and sticks because I've needed those a few times lately. Oh, that's a good one. Okay. Okay. Another pile here. These may be refreshed. Oh, missed. Totally whiffed. Okay. There we go. There we go. And we should go to town. Yeah. Yeah, we're finding metal, that's for sure. Oh, I'll take the bone. That's all right. Okay, let's get him out of the way, just in case. Oh, he's a single shot. All right. All right. Hmm. Oh, he's actually got a decent amount of stuff on him. A coffee can, I think that was. All right, we'll just kind of circle town. Right? Oh, am I turned around again? Hang on. No, town's right there. It's just... can't see it from here. Okay, we've been here. And we're full on water. Oh, wait, actually, you know what? Uh, that one... Okay, it's full, but let me go ahead and do this. Top it off. We need to look for a tent now. Now we need the tent with a sleeping bag. There we go. This might be one we've already drained. Yeah, we already drained this one. Okay. We've been here. Just a few new things popped up while we were gone. That looks like a meteor piece. Now, a meteor will just get us metals. It won't get us any plastic, obviously. Whoa. Whoa, twice. Come on. Level five. All right, we'll check that here in a second. Did I just hear a drinking sound effect? <laughs> I think it was... I thought I still had my drinking glass on me. Met two of the other guys, yeah. Let's try to do a run and strike. Oh, totally whiffed it. There we go. Y'all just throw rocks at each other. He's stuck in the sand. Okay. I don't know what your problem was, buddy. Sorry about that. Didn't mean to just kill you while you were stuck. Oh, there. Okay. We can get bolts with that. Because what in bolts? What were miss? No, plastic, 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 plastic. All right. We'll go to town. I think we've cleaned everything in the general area. We've kind of gone in a circle a few times. Is that a camp? No, that's just a no, that's junk. It's a junk pile. We will check it though, just in case. And then I'm gonna go through because I know I didn't get everything here. So let's go ahead and see if we get lucky, get some plastic. And I might even see. I don't think anybody sells it. Now, one thing you can do. That's another reason why you want to talk to everybody. If I go into like crafting, and if I can find something like materials. And let's say plastic sheet. And when it shows me the plastic sheets, this would tell me normally if there's anybody that sells it. Or if I've run into anybody that offers it for sale. But we haven't really talked to too many people yet. So we're kind of just looting everything. Hope we get those last two pieces. Some more ball bearings. I just haven't seen any sheets, but we're getting bolts. That's good. Some rope. Metal pipe. Okay. Both of these are searchable. Maybe someone threw some plastic away. No. No, we could always take our two liter bottle, break it down. Not that I would ever do that. Oh, no more room. Cockroach. So we're getting full. Yeah, 
Yeah, we may not get the plastic, but we got a lot of it done. Morning's, morning is sneaking in. Some rusty nuts. No loot there. Iron scrap. Maybe, maybe these all came back. I thought I looted all this. Let's hold it. Oh, whoa, 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 what was that? Are we just throwing everything on the ground now? Okay, let me put the empty in my hand. All right, yep. Yeah. We'll be torturing ourselves trying to find stuff. We've already searched these. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, I think um, we'll go unload here. We'll check our skills because we did level up. And then we will probably call it an episode. Good start. Only died once so far. We didn't score a wagon, but maybe if we played for another 45 minutes. But uh, I need to take a little break here. So I'm going to go to our main unit and just kind of... Ah, I did it again, did it again. Bring you back, okay. Try not to get too crazy with the clicks. And yeah, we're gonna be able to make some stuff here, I think, pretty soon. So I'm sure we probably already can. Yeah, make sure I'm not throwing the wrong stuff in here. Oh, did it again, did it again. Okay. Yes, because we're going to want to keep an eye out on finding somebody that buys some of these other weapons that we collect. It should be getting full. I kind of feel like it's going to get full. Of course, 60 uh, liters and 60 kilos is a lot. And just, yeah. Later on in game, it seems like not much because you start collecting so many big things. Okay, so we do have a couple of knives to trade. So let's do this. Go to J. Got 10 more points. Let me think here. I think I'm going to finish off Scavenger. Or no, let's take a break here because it's only we'll be coming up to six soon. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. No, we're still in loot mode. Let me stick. This, yeah, stay the course. What we're gonna do next episode, though, we're gonna hit the we're gonna hit the questing a lot harder, and that'll get us some points, some extra points in here, and get us moving around the map a little bit too. Because um, right now he just wants us to cro uh, craft a crossbow. So what we can do is let's just see if there's any chance in heck. We'll go here, go to now. That's gonna be a short. No, that'll be a long firearm crossbow. We should have. Everything but this. So we go back to tools, hammer. Look at that, we make all kinds of stuff now. Craft that, go back to long. Now what are we missing? Nails, I bet. So let's go uh, speak to our good buddy, Ron. Hey, Ron. Okay, I got a few things. I'm hoping this is enough. Okay. Now yeah, there's only two nails. I think that's what we're missing, though. Go back to craft. Yeah, oh, that might have been all we needed. Okay, now it's telling me the same thing before. i got to separate some stuff. So I'm going to right-click, split, 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 split. So we got two there. We need four wire, so we got to go split, split, split. And okay, we got four there. We need two rusted, so we'll split, 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 split. We got the hammer. Oh, we're short on the nails. Yeah, we need... Oh, wait, no, no. There we go. Crossbow. That's 50 XP. And then he wants us to make some arrows, which that should be easy, because that's just sticks, I think. So let's go back into craft, ammo, arrows. Yeah, just sticks and a knife, which we have our big knife here. Now what it's gonna do, okay, so this is the thing I'm trying to learn. 
We got 34 sticks. Now what's happened to me in the past is I'll hit that and either the knife will break or it'll use up all the sticks until either one or the other runs out. I'm going to split that into 17 and the other stack is 17. And I'm gonna hit craft. Now that time I got, I see, I don't know. I can't figure out the rhyme or reason. We got 20 arrows that time. We had, I don't know. Oh, maybe I had some arrows. I don't know. Well, we got 20 arrows. Okay. Uh, defeat two low lives. We're gonna keep rolling guys. Yeah. I'm feeling a little extra second wind here. Come on, let's go. Hopefully nobody logged out when I said we were getting ready to end. <laughs> okay, we want to do it. Here, put the bed away. Oh, what is that? Oh, that was aluminum. That's iron. Did I drop anything on the ground? I did. Okay, get our inventory. I was trying to double click it and it didn't want to go. There we go. Because it doesn't need to be double clicked. All right. Put everything else away. You're at 63%. And we're going to make you number one. And you're number two. We had a little bit of a stone left. Did we use it up? Sharpening stone? We sure did. Okay. Or I accidentally threw it in here. Nope. And we're. I think we're out of nails. We can double check, but I'm pretty sure we're out of nails. If I try to go to tools, yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, let's go see if we can maybe knock a few more quests down. And then we'll go talk to the guys in town. I know they have some stuff they'd like us to do. They haven't been attacked in a while, have they? Well, we're closer to town, so let's go talk to these guys. And there should be a message board also in town. Right there. You can pick a mission up from here. Yeah, on the board, welcome whoever you are. Help us with safety and you'll be rewarded. Ooh, three bone crushers. Yeah, that's nice. Okay, he has a quest. Okay, he's the bandage guy. Those are expensive, but we'll squeeze them in where we can. Did we drop something on the ground earlier? Ooh, some rope. Okay. I'm trying to see the... Usually there's three or four guys here, but some of them are dead, I think. Okay. Nope, okay. Is that the same guy? They all look alike. I think they're all bucks. Oh, he's got a mission. Oh, he's the one that gave it to us. Okay, so maybe he's the only guy. Man, am I dropping stuff on the ground, or is that just... Coincidence. All right, I haven't seen any... Buddy, bodies, people to shoot at. Here we go. That looks like a big, big guy. Yeah, that's a big, big guy. We're looking for low lives. Now, he's technically a low life, but he's not very harmful, but we'll see. Got to load. You get more damage if you're crouched. Oh, and I totally whiffed that, I think. He's coming at us. Okay. Oh, he counts. He doesn't do much. I don't think you can loot him. Oh, yeah, you can. Okay. He doesn't fight back from what I've had experience-wise. I haven't had any of those guys fight back. Ooh, is there a bed here? There is. Cool. Uh, anybody watching? Nobody's watching us? Okay. Let's get a little bit of, get these Z's out of here. A little sleep. That green campfire is letting us know we're near a campfire if we need to do any crafting that requires cooking. Okay, that should be enough. Let's check the water, even though I think we're full. Yeah, it's dirty water anyway. Okay. Yeah, that guy, we're not, we're, we're not getting any points for that guy. We'll keep going. Reload the bow. The bow has to be manually loaded, just like in, I guess you say, real life. Okay, well, they saw us already. 
Ooh. Oh, we leveled up too. Damn. Ooh, that's good. How many guys do we have to kill? Oh, we already finished. Okay. Really? Okay. I don't know what I got. Gotta get something good. Oh, we got another cross. No, that's our crossbow. Oh, here's our bone crusher. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I always make that mistake. Oh, that would be cool. I haven't tried it. I wonder if you can have poison arrows. I have to throw that one in the old chat. Discord. That was a misfire. You get misfires. This stuff's kind of old racket. You're making out of scraps of metal, so... It does happen. Ooh, I think I... Oh, I hit him. Oh, okay, we'll switch to melee. Finish them off. There we go, buddy. Okay, we got one. Uh, he's got glass on him, but we need plastic sheets. Go ahead and check this place out while we're here. I don't think we've been here. Hang on, that's matches. I saw that out of the corner of my eye. Matches, matches, matches. They are valuable. We should have a couple crates here. Cool. Metal pipes. I'll never look down on those again. Yeah, I was I was going crazy building in the last series. Now y'all didn't see everything. Like I said, I I had recorded three or four more episodes, which I'd have been releasing the next couple of days. But they were just they got worse and worse. The building really got out of hand because I made some mistakes. And like I say, with the early access alpha, you can't tear stuff down just yet. So it, it got to be messy looking. And then when I tried to fix it, as far as like, oh, well, let me just keep building around it to make it look better, it just got messy, yeah. Now you're winded, buddy. I'm mostly doing that for practice. Ow. Psych. Oh, right in the head. Okay. We're just going to keep collecting because we need everything. Everything. Oh, he didn't have anything. Oh, let's see. Yeah, it's all dirty water. Not, not that I don't want it, but we don't have any place to put it. Okay, we've been there. We're kind of going in a circle, I think. Yeah, and then we'll head back. And we'll head back. But we knocked out a few quests, so what now do we have? Make the bandages, kill some bone crushers. Can I make a hammer? How much inventory we got? The backpack is not full yet. Oh, I do have a hammer. Okay. Boop. Hang on. Let's take advantage of this. Before we go there, Jay. Oh, we didn't go up a little. Oh, I got a point. That's where we got a point. Yeah. For doing one of the missions. Okay. That's the noise I heard. I thought we leveled. I was like, yeah, we just leveled a minute ago. Just trying to see if we're going to start seeing more quality stuff come out of the uh, vehicles. We're up to 30 points, I think. I'll check here in a little bit on our scavenger skill. And I noticed last playthrough, I started seeing the quantities. You know, instead of one, it'd be two or three. Yeah, right there, two pieces, two pieces. So it, it really started paying off. But then later we'll get car parts. Some of those parts we need for fixing stuff. I think we just gotta get a few more levels on it. See what's gonna go first. Okay, we still got a little, one little beat left on there. Go back to one, reload. I do like the fact that a lot of stuff can be done while moving. There's none of this, oh, you want a bandage? Stop. Oh, you want a drink? Stop. You want food? Stop. In fact, I think, yeah, he can, I crafted, you know, I did, didn't I? You can craft on the run. It's like, hang on, I got to make some bandages. You just stay a few steps behind me. 
he's already not feeling good, so let's take this guy. Stand our ground. Yeah, this thing's pretty powerful. I didn't realize. Hmm. Maybe because I, well, I only took one, a few points in melee, but damage, or not damage, in a additional damage. All right, hang on one second, guys. Hang on one second. No, no, let's finish this off. Yeah. Get a knife here. Oh, I can't do it with your inventory open. Yeah, here we go. Pick him out. Okay. Now, I, my phone keeps ringing, but it's just nobody I need to talk to. Okay, where are we at? Ooh, no. We don't want to go that way. We want to start heading back. I may have to put my own marker. Yeah, we're going to go this way. Okay. We're going to head back, though. We are getting full. Yep. But we're going to dig through our crafting menu a little more. I don't know if we can make five bandages. That takes 25 cloth and five garlic. Oh, and our hammers probably beat. Oh, can we make another hammer? We can. Okay. Might as well. And we'll know we'll keep the old one. This happens to me all the time. Did I throw it on the ground? Just can't see. Maybe that's a good suggestion. Someone needs to write these down or, or send them to me in a message or something because I won't remember by the time I wake up tomorrow. I just made a hammer, though. This should be maybe when you craft something new that it has a little temporary light around it or something so you can find it if you're in a hurry. But honestly, I don't see a hammer anywhere. Oh, okay. See, I got to remember that. Yeah, we got a whole other spot down here. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and bust this up. See if we get some good loot. Wire. Need lots of wire. Oh, now I did drop something on the ground. Look behind us. What might that have been? Oh, we got a coil. Something new. Oh, no, we didn't. It fell on the ground, too. Oh, metal pine. Oh, no, I forgot. We were full. That's the whole reason we were. Hang on. 61, 60, 49, 68. I'm going to start looking. What can we sacrifice? 46, 49, 52, 52. No. Dang, I hate when this happens. Now, what is it? See, like, this one actually has a little room left. So you could probably play around with, like, can anything fit over here? No. It's just, it's just too close. Too, okay, 0. 0.8. This one's 0. 0.98. 791. Yeah, they're all... It's all about weight. This one actually has... No, no. This is about space. All right. There we go. I can always make another pickaxe. It's, it's a stone and some sticks. Let's see what we can carry. Okay, we got the pipe. So what we're going to do... Smart thing here will be to put the hammer away. Uh, G. And let's grab that pump. And let's head back. Because the sun's coming up. It's going to start getting hot. I'm going the wrong direction. There's our, there's our big boulder that we'd live near. This is where all the water barrels were. That's right. Yeah. Let's run home. Because that pump, I might even go ahead and just put it. I think we needed it for the fuel station. So maybe we'll just go ahead and put it in place. Start building that thing up. That way when we do get a vehicle, we'll have a spot we can come by and get gas when we need to. Another tip or trick I heard there... Once you learn the recipe, you can learn to make barrels, liquid barrels to put liquid in. Stick one next to the pump, and whenever it gets full, transfer it over if you have something like a, an extra container. That way there'll be more to, when you come back later. 
Yeah, it needed the pump. So we'll go ahead and put that in there. Normally I wouldn't want to give up my metal pipes, but I promised myself I would be more efficient and get more of this stuff done because I was skipping these. There we go. What about the blades? Did we pick up any saw blades? I'm calling them saw blades. So we may run back to the car because we emptied out pretty good. Maybe we can go get some more parts. Maybe we'll get luck. Well, that was far away. Oh, there's fuel. That's a squirrel. <laughs> hey, yeah. yeah, I don't have any bandages yet. I'm sure that's going to be gas. Yeah. We just don't have any place to store that right now. All right, let's go ahead. It looks like some stuff's popped up on the ground. I'm trying to remember how far those cars were. They were on the other side of the, they were right over here. But it didn't seem like they were that far. Let's check these all. I think these are all scrapped. Yeah, okay. I guess I could have marked it past the water barrels, maybe. Didn't seem like it was that far away. And I think it feels like it's far away, but it, the timing just seems to be, maybe the movement speed is just the right movement speed. A lot of the mechanics in the game just feel like they've already spent a lot of time testing them. Yeah, there's the cars right there. You know, like they got a lot of that balance out of the way early. Because I rarely feel like it's taken me too long to get anywhere. Some games, you know, there's just, it's a trip. Oh, that was the uh, thing we threw on the ground. Okay. So that one's done. Yeah, if we could get that other... Oh, crap. Whoa! Oh, that's a bandit. And a meteor shower. How far down did he get us? <laughs> I got to keep moving. Keep moving. Keep loop. Oh. Oh. I can't believe I actually killed one of these guys. No, he's got his friends come along. He's coming. Uh, nothing crazy. Okay. Reload, reload, reload. behind the car. Did I hit him? I don't know the range. So they're guarding that container. That'd be a big score. Not that we have space for it, but... Come on. Reload, reload, reload. Oh, we're out of arrows. Uh oh we're out of arrows and that guy's got a melee weapon. I know. I think he's going to do a one hit and I'm, I'm toast. Okay, let's... He's moving fast. Oh. Let go, let go. Craft, 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 craft. Craft, 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 craft. Ammo, arrows, craft. Reload. See, I like that. Ooh, he's coming. He's fast. Come on, don't be scared. Hoping he'll run out of. There he goes. Wait for my play. Come on, don't be scared. I'm waiting for him to lose. Come on, lose your breath. <laughs> Did we get a sex? Come on. I didn't reload, did I? Oh, I only made three arrows. <laughs> All right, uh, two. Hey. Try to run him out of air. Come on. <laughs> Come on, don't be scared. Come on, get tired. Wind him out, wind him, wind him, wind him. Come on, you're gonna get tired, buddy. 
I don't know if I can do the drive, the swing by on this guy. Damn, he didn't want to run out of. Ah, he was running out earlier. Oh, there's someone firing guns now. Now he won't run out of energy. Ah! Oof. Don't play with me. <laughs> <laughs> That's scary. That's scary. God, I can't hit the guy. Okay. I like his gear though. Ah. Got I gotta hit it a little earlier. Hey. Oh, he got me. Or did he? Yes. Shoof. Okay. Yeah, you're dead. Oh. Put a hat on. How much of this can I carry? Oh, crap. Yeah. We weren't really ready for this. Let me think. Let me think. Well, that's the biggest thing would be that. And, oh, oh, no. The saw blade would be nice. Okay, we can handle that. This is gonna be the problem. Too much volume, size-wise. We're gonna have to just leave, because I mean, I don't think this is gonna help us any. A couple stones. Uh, I could throw a plank away. But still not gonna get us. Oh, they did. Let's see this. No, okay, yeah. I'm thinking I can get that back now, maybe, yeah. Now, how much room is here? That's not even, this takes a whole liter. And this is at 7.92.7. So even if I drug enough down here, yeah, it wouldn't help probably. Oh, nothing fits in here. No, we already have half of it. Okay. All right. Yeah, we'll have to sacrifice that. What do we kind of have we got going here? I don't know. Well, we can't carry anything else. Let's head back. That was fun. We didn't get a key, and I started hearing shotgun or some type of weapon fire. That's a good sign that we're uh, getting a little too far out of our comfort zone for the moment. So let's head back. And we'll do one last inventory clean out. So I'm getting a good feel for the map, finally. And we'll check through, because we need a bigger backpack. That's going to be critical. Face mask. We got a hat now. Probably like something different, but look look a lot cooler if we had the cowboy hat on, you know what I mean? But anyway, we'll go through the gear, see what we can make. Maybe some goggles. We have some glass now. We've got a lot of little parts and pieces. Bits and bobbles. And I'll call it a successful day. We only had the one death. We fought pretty hard on that one. I'm trying to remember when the end, I think we just got, that's right, the the one guy got, the bone crusher got a hold of us. Cut us pretty deep. Was it only one death, guys? Ugh. Can't remember. I do know we didn't get any more plastic. So that's what started a lot of this. All right, so let's get over here. And let me just kind of, oop, what happened? Hopefully that's the guys walking around and not bad guys coming after us. Ooh, yeah, we got a lot, a lot of glass. Get that car part. I'm trying to put the other critical stuff in here first. Stuff that'll relate to crafting that we're trying to do without overloading. We're getting close. 52. Matches I can hold on to. Rope. There's our hammer. We got the bad hammer, the good hammer. We'll put the bad one in there. Put the stone, it fit. Cricket will go in there. That's for selling. These we can't sell. Now, actually, these I kept. I had a really good one before. It had some really good stats. I ended up using it as a backup and for cutting stuff. 
Okay. So let's start off under C, under equipment. Now we could make the better pouch. We can make the goggles. Now this bigger pouch. So right now we got the can on the wire. It's one and 0.7. This will take us to, does it tell us? Yeah, right here. Three and 2.5. So at least double. Yeah. And that's not too expensive. Now we already have this one empty, so we can actually grab this one, set it here, and put that one up there. We can still make the goggles. Oh, we can make a chest piece out of bone. Let's make the goggles. And we'll put those on. That even tints the screen a little bit. Chest piece. Oh, damage resistance, poison, overheat handicap. Whoa, whoa. Overheat handicap. So I'm thinking that means it will be hotter. So I'm not ready for that. Oh, this has a green. I couldn't see that. I didn't see that. I've been wanting this because this usually. Uh, air filtration, heat resistance. Yeah, 6% extra heat resistance. We'll get that one in there. The hat we have, overheat handicap. Oh, because this doesn't have any heat resistance. Okay. So we do need to look, keep an eye out for a hat. Okay, we're done on that for now. Let's go to first aid. We've got one towards our goal and two. Okay. We probably ran out of cloth. Let's scroll down. We still got a garlic there. We only have one garlic left, so we'll just keep collecting stuff. But we got we got two points done towards that quest. Food, okay. The grasshopper puree, grasshopper, that because that also uses cloth. So we want, might want to do. Let us go. To materials. Now, this is where he gets again. Oh, I don't know. I can make gunpowder. Oh, take bullets apart. Uh, oh, we can make plastic. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We can cut up our dang bottle. It'll take our bottle. So be careful with that. Uh, what was this? Oh, rope. Okay. I only want to cut one rope. Sorry. Cut one rope up. So this is another test. We have. Oh, I got one in my hand. Hang on. So we got eight rope. So I want to know, if, is it going to make all that or just take one? Okay, it only took one. I'm going to do another one. Okay. And one more. Okay. Just check it. Now let's go back to food. That's what I thought. Uh oh, 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 we didn't drink. Now we're going crazy. Hang on. That's my fault. Yep, it's telling us. So we just made that food. Here we go. Come on, get that going, get it going, get it going, get it going. We caught it just in time. When it gets red, it's really bad. <gasps> and did we make another puree? Oh, no, that'll be a waste. You can't eat more than, like, the water part we wouldn't get here. So we do want to go ahead and grab our bottle. Drink a little bit. Drink a little more. Okay, there we go. And where was I? So this hat, definitely need to upgrade when we get a chance. Uh, I think I was in the middle of this when the, we got interrupted. Yeah. So we're not going to worry about making any more food. I'm just looking. We don't need any materials besides plastic. We could make a ball gun. We can make bone knives, which we can then trade for parts. We can make more arrows. Okay. So our next goal, we already have this bag. The bag up from here is this leather pack, which is six leather, two rope. And we haven't even found leather yet, this playthrough. But also, this one and this one, but these require the workbench being made. Otherwise, they're not bad. 
It's ten and ten. We already did that to make a chest and, and a saw blade and some rope. So this would kind of push us to going ahead and getting a, uh, you know, get a little shack going, a little foundation. And before I've kind of gone crazy, you're not crazy, but building, I'm wondering if I should just, you know, this is a good spot to hang out. We're going to have water. And I like coming back here, at least initially. I did the, all the way up through episode 12 that I've recorded. I kept coming back here to trade in the the knives and stuff to get the uh, nails and the wire for building. So we might, let's look around and see, you know, can we build off of here? Uh, build right next door. They do get attacked a lot, though. Or even we just build a little ways over there. It's kind of flat. We'll see. It's an idea. We can run around. It wouldn't be anything fancy. Just enough place to put down a, the bench and some storage chest. Yeah, maybe I could build off of uh, Frank and them's place here if we went to, like, modular frames. And some... I don't think this can go down until you have a floor. Yeah. So we would have to have the floor first. Oh, the foundation, yeah. Oh, we can't build that close to them. Oh, okay. Okay, they do have a limit or something. Let me see. Yeah, there's some space here that they don't want you building on. Okay. I don't know yet. No hurry. We can't raise and lower these yet. So you can spin them, but we don't really have a way to, you know, get it up off the ground a little bit so you can get the grass out of your uh, house. But that's okay. Put that, oh, put that away. Put our water away. I saw something shiny in here. I like shiny stuff. Nothing else came back. Okay. Yeah, so we did pretty good. We did two of the five bandages. Oh, I was going to see. Did I happen to... We could probably make like one more if we went back in there. Only because we... Yeah. Because we... Oh. Oh, the... Uh, fabric must be something stacked that it doesn't like. Stone. I thought it didn't... If it was in here, it shouldn't matter. Where's the cloth at? Okay. If we put it in here, yeah, if you put it in here, that that goes away. The requirement that it all be together. Because it's pulling it all out of one container, I guess. Yeah, so we just need uh, some more garlic. We have enough cloth, we can make it, we can make that work. And we probably have enough stone, or we can, yeah. So we're, we can finish that pretty soon. Let me look around. Okay, guys. Still feeling good. No, we didn't find a snail wagon. My luck, my luck streak did run out. Uh, we didn't stumble across one anywhere. Of course, I didn't go very well. We did go everywhere, didn't we? Let's see here. Yeah, we did circle the place pretty good. In fact, we got pretty close to the. That's a junkyard, and there's a bandit camp. I think the last snail wagon I got was over here. So. It is random, though. That stuff gets dropped randomly. That's not it up there, is it? That's just a rusted out car. There's a couple of rusty cars there. What are the odds we'll get our little flangy thing that we need? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I don't think we have fall damage yet. Okay. <laughs> that would have been terrible. I just still don't know what all our limits are. Yeah, we can get up here. Okay. Couple cars here. Hey, yeah, let's see. Oh, bolts. That's good. Oh, six bolts. Yeah, we're getting more parts now. All right. Iron scrap. Oh, man. This thing's going to break, isn't it? Yeah. Well, yeah. we'll get one or two more hits, I think. Oh, one more. Okay, that was it. And I'd already gotten rid of the other hammer. And yeah, we don't have any stone on us. Oh, we got some more scraps. Alrighty, guys. Let's head back over to Ron. I know I get distracted. Hang on. I'm going to peek. 
One last chance to see if there's any vehicles out there. No, we've already been over there. Okay. We'll go back to Ron and Frank's. Check in with them. We got to see. We got a town mission. Kill two more bone crushers. So I need to make more arrows for next episode. And then we need to craft two more bandages. We just got to get a hold of some more garlic. And let's check in with Frank and Ron. See if they have any missions for us. Just in case. So we'll be ready when we get back here next time. Oop. But he does have something here. Okay. He wants... Okay, he wants a can of dog food. Oop. And you want... Defeat two low lives. Okay. Easy stuff. Put our camera away. Alrighty, guys. If you're enjoying the series, the episodes, the game, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to check off the notification if you want to get a little uh, notification when a new video pops out. And if you have any tips, tricks, comments, or questions, please leave those down below. I do check them daily. Uh, the new schedule for this game, I'm going to try to be doing daily episodes. So I'll film them day, day one, and the next day after the video will be released. That way the comments will be a lot more interactive. And also, if the developers put anything out, like today they sent me a message about the, you know, the new map system so we could play with it. And iron out the wrinkles before they release it at the end of the week so stuff like that and that way when i learn stuff i can learn from my mistakes a lot faster uh again and if anybody's been keeping track of anything i've mentioned feel free to send me a either comment on the video you know just put it on hey you wanted to tell the guys this or that or ideas i'm gonna have to get me a new notepad up here so i can keep track of that myself but anyway um until next time madstone out